Hey, welcome to the Mega 64 podcast live, coming to you live from San Diego, California. We've got a big week. We had a big week. Oh, Such yeah. a big week. Yeah, yeah. This was one of our biggest weeks, dare I say, ever. Yeah. And why was it? Why was that? Because Count season down. of the force has started. <laughs> All mm. the new Star Wars stuff. Yeah. At Disneyland. Wow. Season of the Force. Yeah. May the 4th wasn't enough. No. No, we no got, it's got to go a season. month. Season. It's Oof. like the um, um, Nightmare Before Christmas skin on the Haunted Mansion. Yeah. That has to be at least seven months of the year. Yeah. We got to do that. <laughs> yeah. It's, it's funny because I, I hate that. Can I think called Summer again? Why does it have to be like Season of the Force at Disneyland? No. It be just like, hey, come on, Summer. I, listen, don't pigeonhole me. That's not all I'm going to talk about. It's <laughs> okay. also... Cigarette month. Um, they're they're doing a whole <laughs> thing for cigarettes. So oh, me, me and Garrett wow, are representing guys. both sides. Yeah, wow. Let's show off, Garrett. Stand up. You want to show? Yeah, yeah. Chris. Get a shot of this, Johnny. Wow, guys. I you I don't know who looks cooler. No, <laughs> how, how do you how do you do that? Did you set up? That's my gut, Johnny. <laughs> <laughs> Well, did you, did you want to show that? Yeah, I did. <laughs> <laughs> I Garrett, gave him five bucks for that shot. Wait, where was the close up on Gar uh, Garrett? Let me see your uh, outfit again. Okay, so tonight's show, we're going to be talking about our favorite, all our favorite Star Wars and, re well, and cigarettes, regular or menthol. Uh, Mentholated uh, Clover? benefits, Kevin. Yeah. Do you prefer menthol? Uh, yeah, I do. Now, the FDA is trying to get rid of them. Oh, those sons of bitches. Well, apparently they're causing a, quite a bit of harmful side effects. Uh, we're going to get into what? that. What, minty freshness? Uh, that's what I'm saying. And we're going to get into that and yeah. more. Looking too cool? After this theme song. Uh, I got cut off. Oh, sorry. Yeah, from what? Wait, wait, wait. <laughs> oh, wow. That's actually loud. Comes out of that right yeah, out of his he's, asshole. He's got, a, he's got a butt. Ew, what, what? was that last part? What was it? Do, do it again. It sounds like it, a toilet it, flushing. It yeah. sounds like this is me shitting. Yeah, I was going to say, in, in <laughs> hut ease, he said, this is me wait, shitting. Do that one more time. I want to hear the last part of it. It does okay. come out the butt. Everyone quiet. It definitely is. There's definitely wet. a liquid. <laughs> Wait. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Like yeah, a splattering. Got gross. What? There's like a bowl splattering. It kept going. Yeah. Yeah. Anyway, sorry about that. I yeah. fucking uh, told you. Rocco, you're really into popcorn lately. This guy loves popcorn. This didn't come with popcorn. One. <laughs> came with fries. Fries? Yeah. yeah. Fry Wait, bucket? Java and it came with salacious okay. crumb. Wait a minute. I think i may be on board for a fry bucket i i oh. popcorn bucket's been mm. done but i yeah. think that's it's a fry bucket now how many fries fit in it, that thing uh well they gave you about that many they oh so that's not 10, fair. 10 like fries. Fill this fucker up. they they sold it at a bunch of different places and you would get whatever that food place had had oh. you know what i mean so I want the if you got bucket. it at a popcorn place you get the popcorn <laughs> you'd get yeah i went where they had fries but then i guess there was somewhere else where they Gave it with a Rice Krispie treat, which is hilarious to me. You just go like, <laughs> there you go. <laughs> well, I that just seemed like New Orleans treat? Square and get a gumbo bucket. Yeah, that'd be cool. Yeah, give me wanna, chowder in there. <laughs> yeah, yeah, that would be cool. Fill them up with chowder and chop chowder on a hot yeah. day out of this thing. <laughs> yeah, because then it would and look like drool. it'd be drooling out yeah. the white goo. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> that would look so right. It would look, oh, and then oh, and oh. then. Uh, he, strangle him with this thing oh. like around his throat. Yeah, you know what? Oh. I agree. Get that should have been the chain that Leia had. Right? That, yeah, that would be that dope. Up. That'd be Yo, dope. Fucked it up. I I think they don't want to um put that stuff in merch. Oh, like the, her in the slave outfit. Her murdering him and the chain. I I don't think they want to conjure up no. that. But, but he why? did come. Who'd he come with? He he came with a uh, salacious. salacious. That looks crumb. good. Is he posable? No. Inarticulate. No. no. All right. Just dangles. But no Bib Fortuna. No. No thermal today. detonator. 
They already did detonators. They've already done that. They you can buy a Sprite that's <laughs> like a speechless. detonator. Oh, Jesus. Is God. there like a, a popcorn bucket, like Twitter you follow to get, keep like, up on all the popcorn just, buckets out there? Just the normal people I follow. Mm-hmm. They all they all, it, they all. The There's figure people. There's got to be some count, account that does nothing but posts Popcorn, popcorn buckets. buckets. I follow this account, um, like eBay Jackets. Oh, and that's a good this, one. Yeah, you follow it too? No, but I've seen your post because I'm following you, so oh. it shows up in my feed now. Yeah, but a lot of times it's just like, you know, it's a lot of the things that you would wear like, oh, this is a shell jacket from 1980s. On yeah, the yeah. Show. That kind of shit. Yeah. I, I enjoy that. I enjoy that. Or they <laughs> brew jackets from certain movies. Yeah. yeah. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. Yeah, but what? Yeah, for like Mrs. Doubtfire. Like that's sick. Yeah, they posted one of those recently. It was, you know, it was like Norbit stunt crew. <laughs> yeah. Like what? That movie had a stunt crew. You yeah, know, I want to see that. But anyway, yeah, I, I love I love stuff like that. Yeah, eBay, yeah. eBay jackets and hats. Shouts out. Uh, well, this was a very big week for us, uh, but beyond the reasons I mentioned at the top of the show. Oh yeah, it was a very big week because we. I mean, every other day had something popping off here at Mega 64 HQ here in San Diego. We actually released our first game ever. Ever. Now, here's what was here's what worked out great about the release of this Go is ahead. you know, I uh, th- there's something about April Fools Day. I mean, April Fools Day can annoy the hell out of anybody. Yes. True. And we've got a record saying that we don't generally yes. like Not it that fans. much. Internet's insufferable that. And day. we started to we so we this is long running Mega sixty four lore. Mm-hmm. We did a video, our Doug Huggum sketch in twenty eleven. We did a, a, at the end of the video, we made a, a joke that we're, oh yeah we're we're gonna make this game. It's all about politeness and good manners and uh, all of that stuff. And it's coming out in March, twenty twenty four. And again, we said that in twenty eleven because it was funny to mm-hmm. say like oh you think it's gonna be this March? Uh, it's in. You thirteen picked years it randomly, yeah, it was definitely <laughs> random random. month. Yeah, like Derek what? just said, a, a year, a month. Yep, yeah. totally. What sounds so far out in the future, that insane, was comical, distance. that the world will definitely be destroyed by then. Yeah, yeah. we'll all be dead. <laughs> yeah, no, but okay. uh, no, we made it, and it w- We started to hear. Huh, I wonder if they're actually going to release Doug Huggum. And, and we started to sweat. <gasps> oh, shit. Oh, we got to get started. Made a promise. <laughs> people know about that? People remember so, that video? But here's the thing. So we started to hype up. Hey, uh, March 2024, like we promised, it's coming out. March 31st, you know, like give us the until the last second mm-hmm. and it will come out. Our plan all along was to then we're going to announce hey, it's delayed till April 1st. And then everyone will go, oh, they're going to pull a fast one. They're going to announce it's delayed again until like 2090 or something, you know, whatever. What's funny is I was starting to get tweets from people that were actually angry. I mean, I get those every day anyway, but (laughs) I I was getting some that were like, I'm, I think it's so pathetic. You guys used to make fun of April Fool's and now you're giving into it just to stay relevant, you know, stuff, just mean people tweets. But what was cracking me up behind all that is like, we, the whole thing we hated about April Fools is that these brands come out, hey, we're going to put out the shoes from Back to the Future. And then the day comes, ah, no, no, we're not. Yeah, uh, like, I, re- I really want oh, those. I, was, I like yeah, those shoes. That's, that's oh, we're going to, we're going to um, release, uh, we're going to have free Crystal Pepsi for everyone <laughs> on earth. Just kidding. Oh, that would have been great. That would have been awesome. Yeah. yeah. I mean, I'm making those up, but you know what I mean? Like yeah. stuff that you would actually look forward to and they just don't do it. Yeah. Well, we've done two, we've actually done two April Fool's jokes now. Mm-hmm. Last year's, we hyped up the thing you've been asking for is coming April 1st. And it ended up being the thing, a lot of things, uh, you know, something that a lot of people had been asking for, yeah. which was the unboxing ring Blu-ray. Yeah. So it was an April Fool's joke, like, yeah. what, you're really making that? But at the same time, people did want it. Yeah. And yeah. we actually made it. Yep. Yep. So we went by the same logic this year, and we actually made Doug hug him. The, we didn't dick everyone around. We actually put a game mm-hmm. yeah. on our website. But- now, Okay, go ahead. Well, the part that was a joke was that we said this would be our Elden Ring. <laughs> well, I think <laughs> it is. That, that part was. Yeah, I mean, some people have compared well, it to. It's our first game, so it's like every game. It's, it's yeah. you know, it's that's also like a Mario Kart if you think about uh, it, because yeah, people yeah. only don't want a game. <laughs> yeah. I think uh, you know, I I saw all the anger and I was like, I love that they're so mad because they oh, think yeah. that we're fucking with them. Yeah. But they're gonna get an actual game. But they're game. gonna get a game. Now, whether they think it's the best game ever made, that's a, that's their call. Yeah, I think it yeah, remains yeah. to be seen. I, I think it I is. had a lot of fun. 
<laughs> and there's it, it currently was, it was like, fun to play. There's currently like huge gamers streaming this online as we speak. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Uh, other people are right, playing it. Literally right now. Right now. Is it Scor Scorby? Scopens, right? Scopens. Sockpens. Sockpens. Scorpy. <laughs> Scorpion. <laughs> Get over Brad here. Brad Neely's Hargnolin <laughs> Sclopio <laughs> Peepio. <laughs> but don't they go, aren't they, don't they oh go by God. Scorpy or am I thinking of somebody else? Yeah, they yeah, do. Okay, okay. So I was, I, yeah. I was right. Scrunt. That's what it was. I get my yeah. senior pillow and my scorpy, you know, confused. <laughs> senior payload. They're, I'm sure they're streaming it. Too. I'm sure. No, but all these, dude, uh, streaming Vinny was yeah, uh, Vinny uh, playing it the other day. Yeah, yeah. Uh, all these, all these uh, uh, luminaries in the industry, uh, dentists, even. I'm just even. even. Dennis. Uh, <laughs> no, but everybody has been streaming it, playing it. It absolutely warms my heart. Yeah. Um, and blows me away that people are doing that. It re I really was more excited for this April Fool's Day than ever. I mean, I was just like mm. so excited that it's like oh, no one thinks they're actually getting a game, but you are. I mean, yeah. sort of, but you are. You no, it's uh, a, hey, it's a game it's a you game can play. Yeah, yeah, exactly. That is a real thing. So uh, anyway, I want to give a huge shout out to Brandon and the team at Get Bonus. Yes, could yeah. give a bigger shout out Be to these people. And you may, if if you don't know the name, you will. We got here on oh, a, yeah. on a past stream. We were looking for weird games to play, and we found Citizen Kane sixty four. Uh, they also made didn't they make Kingdom Hanks? That yeah, was them so too. We, oh my god, we're big two, fans. That's two classic. Yeah, yeah. Yes. Their games, games were so funny. Then we met them. What on tour? Mm -hmm. Is that what it was? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Met them on tour, and they couldn't have been cooler. And uh, and they were talking with me about like, yeah, you know, want to get more. You know, um, they're adding more stuff to Citizen Kane sixty four, like a new update for that. They're doing all kinds of new stuff. Let's stay in touch. Ever want to do something? And then yeah, the Doug Huggum thing started to come around, and it was like, wait, that. This month is when we said it would be Perfect. out. Uh oh. <laughs> but what a what a like universe giving us exactly what yeah. we're yeah. looking for, man. So with we I mean, we seriously, I mean, we we kept saying this is on a you know a 13-year production cycle. <laughs> when the truth is they had a few weeks, maybe. I mean, I would yeah, that, that a few is I would say they had yeah. maybe two and a half weeks. Like uh <laughs> when it was all you, said and done. Possible yeah. to it was, do anything. It was Brandon, I'm sorry. That Brandon you and uh, their team is get bonus. Get yeah. Bonus. So yeah. I think uh, what I heard is when you were kind of running this by the team, I think Brandon had mentioned, well, I made Citizen Kane 64 in a, a game jam, which is like a 48 hour. I don't know if Citizen Kane was part of that, Maybe but they had done other stuff. They, they, they yeah. Cause you were kind of prefacing like, yeah. Hey, the turnaround on this might be like Pretty absolutely quick. ridiculous. Yeah. And I, I think their reply was like, well, we've done these game jams. We farted something out in yeah. 48 hours. So we'll see. Yeah. And, uh, I think they spent a lot more time on it than that. Yeah. Because there is a lot of game there. Surprisingly, like I went through it's like incredible. four or five times. Yeah. There's a ton of Mega Six Four references in yeah, there. And yeah. That's the thing yeah. is, Grink is hidden in there. I'm gonna Grink be, is in there. Like, <laughs> let me be all completely honest. We didn't write no anything. <laughs> really? <laughs> no, we uh, uh what I supplied was the um you know, there's certain like description descriptions of it. I, I don't know if any of my text is actually in the game. I don't mm -hmm. think so. And I gave uh, Brandon the um, the I actually gave him the old recordings from when um, John St. John did. Uh, yeah, the mm -hmm. original recordings we did in 2011, which mm -hmm. can I say that is I think what is legitimizing this game. Having <laughs> having John St. John is having it John St. John it is. Yeah. Yeah. parody his most famous character yes. in yeah. this and it being real. It's yeah. really him. It's really lines from yeah. him. And uh, double checked with him too before, oh, yeah. John, before we did it. Because that and, was filmed with no intention to yeah. make a game no, out of it. In 2011, yeah. Yeah, and so I, I, sent, I sent John St. John an email just to just make sure it was cool with you and I could, it was just a quick, we just had a quick exchange mm -hmm. over the old iPhone and I, but I could feel the, the energy of, uh, wait, you're really doing this? Like, <laughs> like, like the email was like, yeah, that's cool with me. Oh my gosh. What? You know, but, uh, so that, that was out. really cool. And he's always been extremely cool yeah, with us every very time cool. we've done something with him. So anyway, uh, but yeah, but although he didn't do any new recordings, those are the original recordings we made in 2011. And he used that. But other than that, Brandon pretty much put all this together 
himself wrote it all or or, or his team you know yeah. uh, his team too named uh, all the characters he had some friend, uh, friends that get bonus yeah they, they, they named everyone like i like there was like rebecca paypal or something they, like that i don't they, know yeah, yeah, they yeah. usually they, they they like perfectly adapted and followed like the mega 64 naming scheme mm-hmm, like yeah. on their own it was great so um yeah so anyway all of that we were just you know after like a week and a half or two weeks it was just like yeah just checking in how's that going for you and then he sent me screenshots. I was like, "You're you're kidding me. This is unreal. It's this like is so so much good. better than I thought it could ever yeah, be." Yeah. And then we saw like a quick little thing with like dialogue and like, "Oh, we could do voices for that." And so we just, without even asking, recorded voices. Yeah. Like, I just in case you want to put this in there. Like, I don't know if you have time. Yeah, we but, just sent that over. But here yeah. you go. And then yeah, they slapped them all in, and oh my god. Yeah. So <laughs> it, it was all just, uh, and I didn't even know on my end. I'm like. I don't even know, can can this be embedded in our website? I don't know how to do that. Like, so I, I just learned myself how to put that into our website. Really? I, this really? Is, I believe it or not, I didn't ask for help from anybody. I don't, I don't know yourself? shit about that, but I'm just like, no, I'm going to figure this out. I'm going to stay late, figure this out. Okay, let's plug this in. So we found a way to do that, but then uh, uh, Brandon also has a, an EXE, a, you know, uh, a link that yeah, you could yeah, download yeah. it to your PC and play. That's it how everyone's whatever. getting it on their Steam Deck. Yeah, I saw yeah, tons yeah, of people playing exactly. their Steam Deck. That's exactly yeah. really so, cool. So, and that all came together extremely last minute. It was seriously like the night before Easter. Just like, yep. okay, I'm gonna try to embed it on the site. Oh, it worked. Okay. Um. Yeah. Well, I got the executable. Okay. Well, I think we're ready to go. Okay. It couldn't have been more last minute. And mm. all of it. All of it. <laughs> Isn't that you, crazy? How like we've been in this industry for so long. We've heard about the nightmares of launching a game. Yeah. Didn't really Easy. have that effect. Yeah, what are these developers if complaining you about? Work with Git Bonus. It's no problem. <laughs> yeah, they're yeah, working with work with them. Don't work with the. You know. I don't know what the problem is. Uh, oh, the new Last of Us. We were under crunch for two years. Yeah. Uh, whatever. Brandon from Get Bonus. Yeah. Is get out of here, naughty dog. There. We need a day one patch. No, we don't. Ready He's, to go. We don't know. Neil Druckmann's wasting your time. You got to get bonus. Also, <laughs> crunch culture that everyone's complaining about. Yeah, I was up late the Saturday before Easter. Then I slept in and ate deviled eggs. Perfect. Now, I don't know what the Get Bonus is dealing. Maybe they were crunching. I don't know. <laughs> I, 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 I assume. I know. That. I know. Watch, we're going to email from him like, guys, I fucking didn't sleep. We didn't, we didn't sleep, sleep for two we weeks. Sleep. Um, uh, but anyway, they couldn't have been more awesome. Yeah. So I do just want to say just real quick, mm-hmm. uh, I really do want you to check out more of the get bonus stuff, uh, stuff like, like citizen Kane 64 and the other games they made, uh, get bonus dot itch dot IO. Please go there. Yeah. Check out the rest of their stuff, support them, you know, go nuts. If you're a big game publisher out there, use them for your next big game. Yes. Yeah, Higher honestly, down. no shit. Like, do they are so hundred percent great? And our games less. Gl- they he spent that <laughs> amount of time on it, like we just said. Yeah, and it's less glitchy than Cyberpunk was when it launched. True. Yep. Yeah. Anyway. Yeah. So check it out. Also, I really want to appreciate, and no one knows this, but they they we were given this. Yeah. But it's really just a uh, COVID test box. <laughs> but it's a perfect shape. It's rattling around in there. The COVID too. test. Oh, geez. Yeah, there are actual, there are it, it's so funny there. how like that box is like identically the same size. You would never know. Amazing? Yeah, Nintendo 64, 64 box. It so is, cool. but it's just a COVID test. Anyways, it's fine. Uh, yeah, but please, uh, please check out. All, I mean, we already played Citizen Game 64. Yeah. Yep. Classic. And, and uh, the Tom Hanks. What was the other one? What was it called? Tom Hanks? Kingdom Hanks. Kingdom, Kingdom Hanks. Hanks. Was where I fell in love with uh, their work. But yeah, all on HIO. Check it out. Yeah. Mm-hmm. yeah. So yeah, can't, can't thank them enough. And uh, yeah, um, it was so much fun. Like I said, seeing everybody link to our game and, and still and they're still it. playing it yeah, yeah playing right now that. literally as we speak and everyone that i've seen play it it's so funny because like they're all like laughing at it and with it the entire time yeah they're like what the fuck yeah. it's so ridiculous yeah. but uh i think the first person most people do is try to help the old lady cross the street mm-hmm. and i think that's my favorite watching different streamers interact in almost the same way with the old lady crossing the street yeah <laughs> I, I that was a fun conversation too yeah. when i was talking to brandon He's like, uh, yeah, uh, I worked really hard on this Doug Huggum model, but I'm pretty sure you're only going to see him when he gets hit with his car. <laughs> I was like, okay, well. Yeah, uh, you're right. That's the only time you see him. Yeah. Um, there was, al- there was also, uh, there was also um, one mechanic that he was testing, but it didn't work. There, there was originally, I think, a, a, a more involved dialogue thing or something, but he was just like, hey, to get this ready on time, we're you just going to cut it. that. Okay. And then there was also a... Thing where there were um, really uh, goth like 
kind of gruesome looking band posters on different uh, restaurants, you know, like oh, buildings. Interesting. Yeah. And you would go and turn them into a Christian band. Okay, turn them Oh, into that's cool. Band. Oh, okay, there's doom, a cross now. Doom, okay, yeah, doom, you know, doom, yeah. Yeah. But that did, that ended up getting cut too. But anyway, yeah. but other than that, that was, yeah. it's all hey, there. Man. So I've been careful. seeing people like speed run this too. Oh, yeah. yeah. Like, and try to get the fastest time. And yeah. I, I watched a couple of just trying to get it done. Save as Jesus as well. yeah. the fastest yep. time. Um, Rocco, careful when you talk about cut content because we know what happened with Metal Gear Five. Oh, <laughs> Kojima talked Every, about chapter every, three. Yeah, they're gonna they're gonna be hitting us up and asking for a hot fix or a day two patch. <laughs> yeah, day two patch. Everyone's gonna say <laughs> it's a shame Doug Huggum was never finished. Yeah, yeah. yeah careful but, what you say. No, it's it's quite. I think it's perfect. The way uh, it is. Yes. Actually, I think there might be an update Are you coming s- tonight. Breaking news that, that Brandon was telling me about where um, I, I don't remember exactly what it was, but it, there might be like a mode to, to play without the time limit. Oh, okay, so and would you re-download the executable? Like uh, it, it will. Uh, the one embedded on our site would be updated. And then, yeah, I think you want to just re-download, re- re-download that. the yeah. exe. It's, it okay. was, it's been updated a few times just to fix little That's things. That's what I've like heard that. is yeah. that it is being cool. properly uh, supported by the developer. Maintained. Dr. Unlike yeah. Nintendo's yeah. servers. Our servers are still up. Uh, yeah. Dr. Butthugger says that there is a Doug Huggum now um, thing on Twitch. Because you, when we Is played, there really? That's what, he, that's what I just Whoa. saw. Like, like, like a or whatever. And, 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 and <laughs> Vinny Vine Sauce, too, did the same thing. He went to go select the category, and he's like, wait, Doug Huggum's not here. You know, oh, That's yeah. my Vine Sauce. Oh, so I don't know <laughs> if Dr. Butthugger is fucking with us or if that's legit. I, but. That'd be cool. Usually, if enough people like type it in, I think, or petition Twitch to add that, <laughs> they do. It's a game. Yeah. It's a real I mean, game. it's a real game that real streamers are playing. So you can't. And people yeah. are saying, I mean, the Twitch oh, chat is saying it's on there. Oh, it's on there. We so did it. Oh, that's when, great. When we streamed, what, last Friday? Yeah, the day it came out. So that was Monday. Yeah, Monday. Okay. The, it was not out at that point. So, wow. That's um, awesome. You know what's so funny is like, I sometimes I think about like, what would I, if like past me could see future me, what would they think? Whatever. If past me from a month ago saw this podcast, like, what the fuck are they talking like about? Game. Yeah. <laughs> when did we make a game? <laughs> like, Seriously. What game? How? We made a game? Yeah. Well, like Brandon I said, we had a very active week because then that came out Monday. Then yeah. Wednesday, new video we dropped. Gamer, Gamer Dad. Dad. Mm. So good. That came out. We we had been sitting on that for a little bit. Um, and uh we we shot that. We kind of did a two birds, one stone thing. Yes where uh we shot it was the what was it called making money yeah 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 yeah, yeah. video about all the subscriptions all the subscription services Mm -hmm. that are out and all that and um yeah we we kind of it this gamer dad one came first um so i want i want to i want to preface real quick so derek has been obviously hasn't been on the podcast and i think some people have equated that to like oh we're you know, we're we're doing all these new videos because Derek's not on the show. And a little bit of that is true because obviously he's coming up with, you know, he came in with like a, a kind of a script for Gamer Dad and stuff like that. But I think some people have turned that into like, he wants only he wants to do videos and he's like making us do them or something like that, <laughs> which isn't true. We no. love doing, we all no, no. want it. We all wanted to do more videos. Uh, so I, I really just want to, you know, get that out there it's like I, I we've been able to make this work we're trying to like balance our schedule now where we actually have a steady stream of them coming out and um and i'm stoked about it um not me but oh, oh, okay. there you go. <laughs> but 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 i will say in the case of this video this was actually one where he did come in like i have the full thing ready to go if you want to do this idea i don't know why i came up with this but i was walking around and thought about uh, a dude who named his kid Ezio or something something like that. Here, I'm going to write the script. Okay, great. So this actually was his baby. Um he he put me in it as the gamer dad, but he really came up with the whole yeah. like yeah, the whole concept and and he directed it and did all that stuff. Um and I re- you know, I, I improvised a little bit just based off of kind of the thing he wrote, but Sonic, other, other than that, Sonic the Child still cracks me up. Oh, stand yeah. out. <laughs> that, that, yeah. stand out line from the video. Yeah, that 100%. was hilarious. That was really <laughs> your your performance, though. I will say, Rocco is like above and beyond. Like you really kill it as that character <laughs> oh, thank with you. your God. timing and the delivery and everything. Well, I saw a was, lot of that. In the it comments, was really too. funny because again, it was he. So yeah, he so he brought this in and was like. 
yeah, we could do this video and it's just in like some dude's gamer li living room or whatever. But then we we had that subscription idea. We were just in the hallway leaving work yeah. and had the idea for, oh, this video with all the subscriptions and stuff. And then, it be, and then he, he jotted all that down, put it into a script. And then it was like, well, okay, we can shoot both of these on the same. Garrett's going to make a, a living room set mm -hmm. and we could dress them up different for each one. Yeah. But it was kind of decided like, hey, the subscription video feels like that's hitting that that's hitting hard right now. Like everyone is going, what's with all these subscriptions? What's with all these layoffs at all these companies? We should get that out first. So we prioritize that and then had a bunch of other videos come out and now this one but we did we shot them kind of in the same day they were though, shot really? the same day yeah, yeah yeah on the same set and so yeah. i remember i don't know why we did this but we shot half of the subscriptions video the what's called was it making money yeah and then we changed all the lighting changed the sets and we shot the entire gamer dad video and then like we thought like oh we should film more of the subscriptions video. I don't know why we didn't film the whole thing for it. We should <laughs> so we had to like redo all of our work and like put it back to how it was. <laughs> why did we do yeah. this? Shooting out of order. We yeah. shot out of order. So that was really fun. And um, yeah, I mean, uh, we kind of, I don't want to say too much, but there are um, some people we know that, have, that talk the way that I was talking in that video. Sure. <laughs> um, yeah. Oh, yeah. And uh, and and Derek wrote it off of his experiences, but I also was kind of was bringing. Um, there's someone we knew somewhere, at, somewhere that worked, you, worked at somewhere we went that had that really talked the same way and named their kid something like that. <laughs> <laughs> you know and so we yeah. we kind of met in the middle of that it was like Der derek we literally like at this place we've talked to this person this is so oh, great. true to form cool so we we um so we all brought personal um experiences to the table so anyway so i'm glad two people seem to dig it so yeah that was uh, a lot of fun yeah really enjoyed sherilyn's portrayal of the oh yeah, yeah the yeah, trad yeah. wife yeah. is uh the the comments are calling her yeah um and she's shown up in a few other things yeah. Uh, you might start to recognize more Sherilyn. Another great actor to have on hand. Yeah. yeah. Um, and uh, yeah, all I was going to say other than that, I, I, oh yeah. So we, we shot, it was, it, it really was an out of nowhere idea. It was like, oh yeah, let's, okay, let's do it. I, I mean, the, the idea is all here. Let's just do it. And then when we filmed it, I, I couldn't get a sense of like, is this good or not? Cause it, you know, it's just, it's me doing all that. So I'm like, I don't know. I'm, I'm going to try to make you guys laugh, but like, did this, come together into a video i i don't i don't know mm -hmm. i'm i feel like i've just been wasting everyone's time you know just you know i don't know yelling shut the fuck up into my air <laughs> like, shut up i don't no. I, you know but it was fun to record it so i'm like well hopefully that'll carry across another thing and then uh yeah and then i watched the edited version i was like oh i love this this, this is great. great i was really yeah. stoked with it so yeah it all it all came together but you never know when it's um when it's you kind of saying most of the dialogue it's hard to like I don't know. Get like, a picture I, of what's. Actually, yeah, I, I'm not like, like if an, I watch Sean doing something, I can be like, oh, I could see this already. Like how yeah. we're going to put that there. Oh, this is going to be great. But I can't when it's just me like, I, oh, I dropped the cake. Was that funny or am oh. I or am I an asshole? No, no, no that, that was, was hilarious. You know what I mean? Yeah, when that but happened, I was like, yeah, that, that sitting was on the cake. You don't even drop it; it slides by. And I just felt like that's gonna seat. suck to clean out, but this is worth Still it. Still funny. Such a funny <laughs> shot. Because <laughs> yeah. as a viewer, you're like, that's the worst. That's the worst thing <laughs> that the cake could do. <laughs> yeah. Oh, it slid down his fucking chair. Oh. <laughs> um. So yeah. Anyway, so I was really happy that all came together. We showed that. We showed that first at PAX, and then it came out. Um. Obviously, Wednesday. So cool. Anyway, yeah. Go check it out. If you haven't already, uh, Gamer Dad, it's on YouTube, our new video on YouTube. I love the lighting in it, too. Yeah. yeah. Did you did you do that with Derek, Johnny? Did you both like that, or was that just... Uh, I helped him light the subscriptions video, but Gamer Dad, I think, was all Derek. Oh, okay. okay. Oh, cool. Okay. I didn't know that. That's awesome. Well, both of those videos look great. The, um, the making money video looks like a Sears commercial, and this one... Looks like vomit, which is perfect for the character, <laughs> yeah. and it's great. So anyway, uh, so yeah, check that out if you haven't hadn't already. Yeah, and uh, that so that we had that on Wednesday, and then Friday we dropped our uh, Mega sixty four farewell tour Blu ray, which is out now. You can order it now. Um, we all worked out really hard on it. Um, I kind of talked about this. 
uh, as well on the, we did a launch stream. Oh, that's if, right. If you yeah. missed it. That was fun. That's on our archive channel. By the way, in case you don't know, in case you're new to Mega64, we have a second channel. Mm. Uh, look up Mega64 Archives. Um, that is our second channel. On YouTube. Yeah. We look, we upload all kinds of stuff there. And uh, we put up, yeah, the stream that we did to launch uh, the Blu-ray coming out. And uh, that was really cool. And I talked about it on there, but the Blu-ray is already done and it's it's been in the pipeline. So you won't have to wait. You won't have to wait very long. Mm. Just give us give us some time to ship them out and all that and fulfill it. Um, but uh, you know, hopefully in the coming weeks, everything will will go out. Um, mm -hmm. it's all looking good. But um, anyway, yeah, uh, me and I, I'm usually I'm usually the one guy authoring the the Blu-ray. I mean, Johnny worked on the uh, he cut like the show together. God, um, the, the live show. Of, he well, shot every live show when we thing. were on tour. Mm -hmm. You know, and put them Johnny, together. every show had to go to every sound guy, mm -hmm. which I'll tell you, that's not is fun. not a fun task. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Not fun. Yeah. And had to be like, hey, uh, can I, you know, tap into your board, get some audio and whatever. And he, set up cameras. It, it, it was just, and some guys are like, mm, I mean, the venue is going to charge you a couple hundred for that. And some guys are like, yeah, all right. Yeah. Let me get to you in a half hour. It's never easy to just like have this work out. Yeah. So, so kudos to Johnny for doing this and then every he night of the tour. Filmed every night, and then he stitched it all together to make one complete package. And and the <laughs> amount of editing yeah. that goes into like finding the best parts of yeah. How many shows were there? Fourteen on that tour. More than that. It was yeah. a lot. He had it's to a go lot through. of yeah, footage was, to now compile. I think it was uh, yeah, at least eight, at least eighteen to twenty or so, something like that. Yeah. Just like the last laugh, our hats are off to Johnny on yeah. how fucking awesome this new one came out too. yeah so he 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 put that together and then what I, what i was going to say was normally when it just comes to like authoring the, the blu-ray like making the menus and putting all that together it's normally just me but Der derek actually did sit in on this one he he, he reached out just like hey let i i normally it's just you doing this i want to see how you do it <coughs> i want you know and he was already coming up with like ideas for like future he's like you know i got ideas for for some physical media stuff in the future that we could make some really bizarre like blu-ray releases and stuff like that and yeah. i, I want to see how you do this here or okay, just from cool. seeing how the mm -hmm. authoring process goes yeah yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. it's oh, I just, what you can embed it's in nor menus yeah and, oh. it's normally just me doing that because i learned how to do it you know 20 years ago yeah, and with it's version two it's right? tedious as hell so i'm like you can but you might lose interest real quick like it's boring uh but no we literally sat there together and in one go did the whole thing we did not leave my office until that Blu-ray was done. And nice. I was surprised. He was like super engaged. Oh, that's cool. Uh, I think this was a good one to do it because sometimes like when we put our master collection Blu-ray uh, thing together, oh. that is like, okay, a, a billion episodes with a billion more uh, audio commentary tracks. That I think is maximum. That's, that's like maximum boring, but and it all, this it, was pretty good. This it was all has good. to go in the right order. Yeah, too. yeah, yeah. It has to be cataloged. You're dealing with stuff across multiple decades, but the tour Blu-ray is fun. It's like, mm. oh, here's... Oh yeah, here's the footage. Uh, here's us reviewing pizza at the you know thing. Okay, I'll, great. You know, so it was actually maybe kind of fun to engage with. But anyway, um, yeah. So we did all that, and it, so uh, everyone's kind of had a hand in this. Uh, there's a I, I I I ran off the list of things that are on our tour Blu-ray, but there's a whole second show on the Blu-ray um, from Florida when we did a test show yeah. that did not work. Like there was a lot of gags that were like, ooh, cut that. Or uh, or even like some that were like we could we could do something better. Let's do that. And vi even videos that we made that played on stage, those mm -hmm. videos are in there. All that stuff. But Sean put that together. Um, so we really kind of all had a hand. Which I was thinking about this. Uh, I love that whatever we do, mm -hmm. anything here, it is all of us working together, yeah, yeah. and mm -hmm. we all yeah. would just do random things to make sure that this task is completed. Like, yeah. but it's always. Everyone always has a hand in something at some point along the process. Like, yeah. you know, it's like, you know, Meg does the cover and puts that all together yeah, for yeah, us yeah, in yeah. menus. And then, like, we, we, I just feel like we always have, like, Garrett's doing this and Kevin's doing this. Like, we're all working together. Yeah. Because to yeah. it's only such a small crew that we Yeah, there's are six all, of us. Well, with seven with Meg. Yeah. But, like, it's yeah. all of us, like, 
figuring out a way to get this all done together because like otherwise it wouldn't work. So. Yeah, yeah. I really the only thing with the farewell <laughs> tour is Kevin didn't really do shit. No. Oh, no. come on. So where we're kind of where he's were gonna you? when these yeah. ships them all out. No, I'm not shipping them out. <laughs> yeah, he's not doing that. No, he no. Me, he put no. his, he oh, put his no. foot over them, but like oh, yeah, no. he put they're, his foot down. On yeah, that's it. Yeah, I don't know. He carried <laughs> your bags <laughs> out of every hotel in every city. <laughs> that's true. He loaded them he, into the van for you. Made sure we didn't forget any costumes. Oh, I did. Kevin, I do. I do what's called the once over. Last look. I, I love. Yeah. yeah once Kevin over. is always like the last that person was. in the van. All right. I'm going to give the once over. And then he'll go into like the people in the venue are like backpacks on ready to leave. And Kevin's like, one second. And he'll get his flashlight, flashlight out and he'll look at I'll, every corner of where well, we were. You need to do that because like, yeah. hey, here's a phone charger was in the green I room. found some stuff. Here's yeah, an sure. audio DAC that was left on a table yeah. or something. Yeah. I My mission was to lose one thing and have Kevin not find it. And I did it. Here's so, the blood. I did lose our RTX hat. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. What happened with that? I think Halfway it was behind a curtain tour. in Portland. Honestly, I, yeah. I can think of exactly where it would have been. And there's no way Kevin would have ever thought to look behind you. What character wore the RTX hat? The hacker. It was a hacker. Oh, so yeah. it's only for the last bit of yeah, the show. Yeah, yeah, okay. Yeah. I just ended up taking this hat and just turned it backwards. Cool. You look like a hacker. Works. Yeah, thank you. Yeah. yeah, yeah. I feel like a hacker. <laughs> <laughs> little script kitty Sean here. <laughs> uh, yeah, yeah. Well, um, anyway, yeah. So, uh, really, everybody... Contributed a lot to that show. So and, and you streamed um, and the, Friday. And yeah, 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 yeah. Thursday night. Thursday yeah, night. Yeah. Thursday and it night. went on sale. It's it's now up. You can get it yeah. currently at shop.mega64.com. Shop.mega64.com. We did a whole uh merch drop for the tour. We have the the tour shirt is on sale. The we have the Blu-ray, but also like a, a bundle with the, the Blu-ray where you could get like the VIP badge, the the uh NFT uh physical certificate, which it, it's not you you once you see the show, you'll understand what that is. Mm -hmm. um, it's tied into the story. So if you want like a physical, you know, part of Prop. the show, yeah. you'll have that. Um, those, all of that is on sale. But we did something <laughs> none of us expected. Uh, when we put this all out, we thought it, we'd be clever. We found a, just a small little stack of Last Laugh yeah, Tour. Just like a handful. Our, our Last Laugh Tour was the first tour we ever did. Mm -hmm. Mega Sissy War Last Lap. Different from the Farewell Tour. Totally different shows. And way different show. And that was our first leg of the first. Like we That was early 2020 before yeah. COVID. Yeah. Like, Pre-COVID era. I mean, very first weird. First leg. Just yeah. as yeah. everything was starting to close. Yeah. Um, but anyway, uh, we, had a, we did a Blu-ray of that. It's been out of print for years at this point. We had a stack of them, so it's like, oh, we'll put that out, and it sold out in you know point one second oh, awesome. or something like that. But then we met up the next day and had and at the meeting we were like, should we reprint that? Should we? we? And we looked into it, and it was like, okay, if we do one small run, it won't take that long. It will, we'll probably have them. Probably, I mean, it's already done, yeah. so we, it probably will be here around the same time as the other tour Blu-ray, pretty close to that. Uh, okay, fine. So we did that is in our store. Oh, it's back up. We, on sale. We, we we, yeah, we made sale. the calls yeah. and all that that day. It's like, okay, it won't take you that long. All right, great. So if you want to get the last laugh tour, but I don't, I don't think we're going to do another printing of that. Probably. I think um, this is it. One more chance. run uh, is probably good on that. Uh, the last laugh tour Blu-ray is up now. Shop.mega64.com. Yeah. You can get both tour Blu-rays. They're mm -hmm. up right now. And, um, yeah, if you missed out, I I think what a great double feature. Oh, yeah. the first Completely tour and our last easy. tour. Yeah, I'm not doing that shit again. Yeah, <laughs> yeah what are you gonna? We're gonna write a third show. You know, hard no, that was? Yeah, fair, <laughs> last laugh, farewell tour. Yeah, yeah. Bye. If you do a third tour, what's it gonna be called? We're oh, oops, we're back. <laughs> oops, one more. Oops, all jokes. Oops, all um, jokes. One more show and then we're dead. I think that's actually a good. That's tour. Oh yeah, yeah. Catchy. <laughs> that's a catchy title. Yeah. Uh, but anyway. So yeah, get all that stuff, shop.mega64.com. And uh, we also have a, uh, we did a merch drop for Doug Huggum too. So if you really liked that game, um, we did, we have a shirt by an uh, 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 artist that does a ton of wrestling yeah. stuff. Yeah. Oh yeah, that's and, right. Um, and a uh, really great artist and, uh, and they did a sticker set too. Mm -hmm. I've seen them all, working with West a lot lately. Yeah, yeah, yeah. They've done a lot of great stuff. Um, all this stuff is on shop.mega64.com right now so yeah, go get out. that stuff if you can yeah that was talking about we were talking about our work but it segued it segued into, into the, the plug, into the plug. So yeah, yeah, yeah. i did the plug well, yeah it's fine that works out it was a big week for us and it kind of leads in can we also say that. that we got in the the vhs um and those will be going out shortly yeah oh, a yeah, bunch yeah, of them yeah. already been 
packed up. So <clears throat> packed yeah. up. Right. Be You're talking the the MLK, MLK the movie. The movie yep. uh, is on its way. So we're yeah. expecting the master collection soon. Yep. So yep, that will be on its way soon. Yep. So yeah. it's all in the works, people. We're yeah. killing it. Yeah. You know, I think that 2023 was such a clusterfuck of us trying to figure shit out and get things out to people that yeah. this year we're, our mission was like, we're going to do a shitload of videos and the merch is going to be fucking pristine. So, <laughs> yeah, we, uh, we, I think I, I, I think I said this on the stream. I don't remember, but uh, last year felt like the uh, constipation year. And this is and this year <laughs> this is, is the dire, this is the diarrhea year. Sweet release. Where it's like, oh my God, we were backed up that whole year. You know, we were touring. At the same time, we were trying to fix like 80 broken things behind the scenes that were like, okay, the, the this Blu-ray we've been trying to get out was all, was held by this, and we got to fix that. And we, there were so many things. And uh, fucking Suez Canal. Yeah, I feel like we're like reaping the benefits of everything. Yeah, the Suez Canal. Yeah, that fucking fucked boat. Us. All of our, yeah, Blu-rays were on there. Our, our, you know, all our fucked stuff us, was on dude. there. It was all fucked up last time. But this it is. It was. But this this is, is great. smooth sailing. And yep. all the physical media that's getting popped yeah. out of this studio i love yeah. it um i wanted to poll you guys because the the gamer dad video going back to that mm -hmm. it kind of brought up i think a lot of the standouts like you said sonic the child etzio yeah. all these names mm -hmm. is there a is there a like tolerable video game character you would name your kid after oh because that like really i said like I, I, uh, like i've got i've got now you know friends and family that have started naming their children like after say comic book characters sure. or like movie characters yeah, yeah, yeah. like there was this is an example but there was a string of uh what was the Callista, the khaleesi uh, khaleesi all these girls oh my god khaleesi. that was a thing that, that was a that. big thing yeah. you, know, right? crazy? you know what's funny though is Pop like i see that. that in the wild sometimes because my kids are the same age of so there are uh, like you're seeing I, Khaleesi's. I, yeah. they there was uh yeah lynn had a class with the khaleesi yeah yeah, the gymnastics oh class. Oh my god. Ah, gymnastics a long time so ago. That just makes it ten times funnier. That's so <laughs> that, that character went off the deep end. <laughs> yeah. Like you don't want to name anyone after that. No. The show wasn't even over and you name your kid after what could like, you, you could have committed is, heinous acts. She did. She did. Yeah. Yes. I didn't see it. Oh, that, that's that great. Is a that, is so that was a good. symptom of a terrible thing that was happening at that time. I remember, I remember in like 2012 or 2013 asking somebody all right what's your favorite show of all time and they were like oh game of thrones and i'm like aren't they just starting season two right now yeah, yeah but it doesn't matter and i'm like i think it matters and i would wait <laughs> yeah yeah wait and yeah. there we are everybody you were right mm -hmm. yep. um, but yeah what a name a name know, from a game because i more movies you know, sonic would, the child is so fucking good yeah and your line delivery is so fucking good but like Ezio, i could see someone actually doing that like yeah we're italian i love you know, Assassin's Creed. I could, I could see Ezio yeah, at being least Ezio, real. Ezio's a name. It really is. That's it actually right, is. Right. A, a, a well, that's Italian. the thing. Is like you know, I mean, Zelda. Zelda is a, a name thing that happened. Yeah. Well, that is a name that existed in the world before what? this game. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, that's yeah, like a yeah. 1920s name. Zelda yeah, is it's an old, old It's like name. Mildred. It's like an old lady name. Yep. Yeah. Yep. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. okay. So Zelda like Rubenstein from Poltergeist and stuff. That's right. Her name was Zelda. Yeah. Ah, so towards the light. I do think that yeah, Zelda Fitzgerald. I I I think that. I don't, you know, because I, you know, strife. I've got in my my I have kids with Cloud different names. Chatfield. My 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 kids' names are, you know, not the normal, yeah, names. You could get away with naming your kid Tifa, though. Yeah, you right. Oh, yeah. But that might be a little weird. Like eh, you named your daughter Tifa. I mean, yeah. <laughs> I mean, it's all weird. <laughs> to me, yeah. it, 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 it all weird. depends. It's all it all weird, depends because, right? like, I knew someone who had. So much Star Wars shit everywhere, mm. and then they named their kid like Leia. no, like it, it, it was like J, J. It was like I don't. I don't oh, it was like a character creator name. It was like it, Jabin Star. You know, it was like Anakin something. Yeah, you know, and it was like oh man, and like that was like too much. <laughs> the kid's gonna hate. But you it. know, you name a kid Luke. Oh, and that's it happened to be from that. Well, that's, okay, that's cool. You know, I'm not I'd say, I mean, my it. brother, I'm pretty sure, yeah. was named from that but but that's the thing you can name it but just don't say it like don't go oh i named him luke because After of star wars True. I, I, think, it, I think i think keep it, it quiet yeah keep it quiet i think You're it's right. a, even if even if you don't i think you could get away with it if it's not um like oh here's my i've got a, a planned naming scheme yeah. for all my kids dude because i'm a big uh super sentai fan so i'm gonna name my kids uh <laughs> shider go kaiger yeah, <laughs> yeah shider this that that 
you could it's just the, everything in balance you know what yeah, i mean yeah, everything sure. in balance that's I all i say feel. and i don't think i've said this on the podcast before but my parents i don't know i'm assuming they were joking but i was six at the time mm -hmm. so when yeah. my mom was pregnant with my sister they said if it's a boy we're gonna name him picard and what? i was like what he's like yeah because you're sean that's close to jean so it'd be sean luke oh, picard. picard and i was like what? this can't be real uh, three kids are the and name. i remember being a kid being like mm, no i don't <laughs> think so I think they were fucking with me. I yeah. never got clarification <laughs> on that. You should ask them. To see I, that they probably don't remember, <laughs> honestly, that shit. wasn't a boy. Right? Because I would find out the, the hard card, way that yeah. if that really the was card. a place, the the like Sean Luke card, 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 that's terrible. When I was a kid, I always thought if I had a son, I wanted to name him Cecil. Okay. Because that was the, 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 guy, the, Fantasy, the right? guy in Final Fantasy mm -hmm. 4 starts, and he starts like bad, but like learns to be good and I always thought that was a powerful story and I thought that's obscure enough that I know what it is but no one else does. Yeah. But now it sounds like another uh weird like a lion. white people name, you know what I mean? <laughs> yeah. like, uh, I'm Cecil gonna him, I'm going to name him Quest. Cecil is a name, Cecil. it just hasn't been used in a long time. Yeah, yeah, which, yeah. Which those, I guess you still could do it. Those names come back like uh, uh, there's a lot of girls named June now which mm -hmm. oh, was a, kind of a yeah. old lady there's name. A lot for a while but yeah. i think that's coming back I'm, esther's coming back yep. yeah i mean my mom's name is nancy and that went away but i'm starting to see that come around yeah. you know what I you know what's gone mm -hmm. uh jason and karen oh karen, karen oh, is karen, like karen that's, is that's erratic it. gone, <laughs> that's gone. Yeah, no one that's is it. naming their kid karen no one. <laughs> i feel like the name's like justin there's no kid justin out there anymore right <laughs> like that's justin. not a, that's not a thing Justin. i don't is it i don't, I don't think I so i don't know I, I, i've been around many kids in many classes and i don't think i've heard no. one justin I, no more justin i always no. i always love when the twitch chat holds work like there's a there's a bot on twitch that holds offensive terms like do you want do you want to allow this person to keep talking yeah, in the yeah. chat and some they just held someone because they okay this person just said gaylord <laughs> that was a very that, yeah. that was a name that was that was a very gay lord in our high school i only, didn't want I only that. hear names when i'm at disneyland and like a kid's in trouble yeah like hey come uh, here too i hear like Bryler, Bryler, get over here yeah yeah, yeah. the, <laughs> the like worst that. worst i think of all time is still i remember having that talk with you it was you me and brian yep. at disneyland hearing magpie Magpie! What? Magpie, yeah. get back here right now! No way. Just a little boy named Magpie. That's, That's not sucks, real. Dude. What kind of fucking lost boys <laughs> shit is that? You Mag know what though? Magpie. Disneyland? Hey, at Disneyland, you get people on vacation from like the South. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Maybe yeah, I think maybe, these. No, I think they lived here. Maybe I think, Magpie. I think they were LA people yeah. from Oklahoma Magpie. or something. Magpie. Yeah, That's a Magpie. wild one, dude. Magpie, get here <laughs> now! That um, don't ruin this for me. That is a yeah. There are some names that yeah. Yeah, yeah. I don't know if I could do the video game character. I don't, I don't think know. there's an appropriate one. But you can snake. if it's very obscure. <laughs> <laughs> I know. Sol Solidus. Solid Solidus. Snake. I honestly feel hey, like that is not right. Hey, Solidus, people would do that. I would actually give you props. You name your kid Solidus. I'd be like, all right. You did it. You did it. Yeah, you Solidus, did it. Solidus, get over here. Like, let's go like a, go Drebin. Drebin. What do you Drebin. want for dinner, Dre little Drebin? <laughs> Be like, what do you want for dinner? Oh, chicky nuggies? Yeah, well, I'll make them. And don't forget, I have you. <laughs> um, a little MGS4 here. Yeah, I don't think it's ever appropriate. Unless it's like you're saying, like, it's a real name, like Vincent yeah. or Cecil. And you're going to be like, okay, I like Final Fantasy. It's a good, na it's a good name yeah. regardless. Yeah, but no it, one's going to know that. If it's a good name regardless, and it's like, like... Joel and Ellie are normal names. Yeah, yeah, but, yeah. And you can name that. And if you don't say anything, then it's just then a no normal name. Yeah, but yeah, you can yeah. always go like, yeah, I love those games. But, okay, I'll do that. Yeah, again, I just feel like everything in balance. If it happens to be something, yeah. hey, you know what, whatever. Yeah. But if it's like, again, four, you have four kids named after the all Autobots. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> like, you know, okay, chill out. You know, well, that, that character, Jenny, her favorite, she loves the book Tom Sawyer. Mm -hmm. And that's where we got the name Sawyer. But then when she pushed that to me, I was like, well, I love Lost, so I'm happy. That's fine yeah, with me. Yeah, you know, yeah, like, yeah, yeah. but that wasn't the reason for it. But also, like, it didn't hurt. I'm curious. I'm curious who out there, what's the worst name you've heard in terms of, you know what I'm talking about? Uh, like, uh, you know, that somebody's the, named their child? Yeah. Oh, like, I, oh, yuppie, I, yuppie yeah. names uh, for I, kids. You know what I mean? Where it's like, I'm, I'm going to name my kid great. 
I, well, I, that, I think that's the shit. one that that is a real one that I, I have. One. Great. Yeah. You're naming you, your kid great. Do you, can what if you he say sucks? it? Uh, Will you get in trouble? I don't know if I even know removed? this person. I just heard this from through the grapevine mm. that somebody named their child Slain. Slain. Demon Slain. Oh, that's terrible. And I'm like, Ugh. Slain. Yeah. Um, even Slate sounds like a caveman. I'll I'll just say every one of Nick Cannon's kids has the worst fucking name. <laughs> oh, really? I've ever heard. <laughs> All right. <laughs> I, I don't know any of the names. Oh, know. it's like Powerful Millionaire Princess oh. Deja Vu. And oh, like, no. Oh, that, I, I would look it up right now, uh, but I don't want to uh, make fun of literal children on the internet. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. But, yeah. but <laughs> I'll make fun of their dad. Nick Cannon and Mariah Carey have named their kids like the yeah. worst fucking uh, names I've ever heard. I am a firm believer that all these weird names you see celebrities name their kids yeah. are fake because they don't want their real names to be out. Oh, like ah. Apple? So they'll just make up yeah, yeah. these Apple. weird names. Surrey? Yeah, yeah. and uh, when they go to school and stuff, they'll, 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 their name, they have, they basically are born with a stage name. Yeah. I, 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 I think, I think that's the case. Oh, that's Kevin, interesting. I've never once these men, that? Like, Kevin, like, like yeah, all these people smart. that are like, oh, this, this name is a bunch of letters and numbers. I think it's totally fake. That's a stage name and they have a real name that they do not tell anybody. I thought Gwyneth Paltrow was just fucking cuckoo for coconuts. No, I but. mean, she, she, she is. She could. She, she made vagina yeah. scented candle. <laughs> yeah, I mean, I don't know. I don't know. But Grimes is actually smart now, giving her yeah. child anonymity. I don't think that is their real name whatsoever. I think that is just the for for the tabloids. Gotcha. Mm. Okay. Gotcha. And okay. That, and to keep their privacy. That's not you know what, to Kevin, themselves. That's and, not a bad conspiracy Because what theory. kid wants to be like like well, their name made fun of immediately? Like, well, it is, but <laughs> like <laughs> like they, they give her given a real name. Trump's and kid's got a, a rotten first name too. <laughs> Baron's pretty fucking bad. That's right? a bad name. That's a bad. Kind of, it just sounds like a, a, villain, a villain. Yeah, it's yeah, yeah, villainous yeah, yeah. from the go. It does. Baron. Yeah. You'll never now, cross the Baron. <laughs> the worst name I've I've seen in the wild. I've I, I there was a kid that went to like a a thing that we went to with a name. I don't even know if I should. I mean, I felt bad even saying it because I feel like I'm making fun it, of a it's kid. It's a kid. Yeah, yeah. They they don't think. Oh, sorry. Kids they, don't uh, care. Just broke my phone. <laughs> That's second one in my life. Um. um <laughs> Yeah, what were you saying? What were you gonna say? Well, I just I don't want to, you know, like, what do, do I say it? Like, I don't even know. Like, I feel bad. Are they gonna watch this? Probably not. And I don't know these. I never met the parents. Oh, yeah. so these are strangers. I yeah. let it fly. Well, the 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 kid's name was literally Skywalker. That was the first name. Mm. It's kind of cringe. First name Skywalker. First name was Skywalker. Skywalker. You might you might be able to get away with a middle name. Yeah, that's rough as a first. That name. was the that was the first name, and I, I was surprised whenever you do that you have to give a middle name that they can like choose if they want to go by later go by that yeah yeah hmm. it'd only be cool if like the middle name was sky and the last name was walker so it was like luke sky walker yeah that now it's cool now it's cool. yeah <laughs> you know but like <laughs> no never mind it's in the chat like you could, you could call the kid sky i mean that's, yeah yeah, yeah. That's, a, that's a nickname that's fine. sky guy sky guy just like uh she what's her name yeah, you know, like middle names are whatever. They could be anything. So yeah, yeah. I guess. Uh, 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 Pendulette's uh, da uh, daughter is Moxie Crime Fighter Gillette. <laughs> <laughs> See, that's kind of fucked no. up. Crime Fighter. Yeah, but, but, it, but it's a middle name, so you just Moxie. don't reveal it. He yeah. named her Moxie. There's, I've, there's, I've seen several Moxies. I've, in this she's world. got Moxie. I don't know. That's a <laughs> that's an old name. I liked that's um, an old name. Yeah, I old liked name. Uh, the guy in Jackass going by Jasper. I, I was like, Ooh. yeah, Jasper's Jasper, a cool name. Jasper, Jasper was cool the name. one that you'd only hear in old people for a long time. So I like that coming back around. Yeah. I do think that a lot of those old school names are coming back. Yeah, for yeah. sure. Ka Karen, you said it was off the off the yeah, block. Karen's but gone. Carol has been coming back. I Carol, think. that you yeah. that for a minute you only knew eighty year olds with that name, but I think mm -hmm. that's coming back around. I also think okay. it's kind of a thing too, where it's like maybe a grandparent dies, and then oh, they the, name the, them after the grandkids yeah. name totally. their kid after the grandparent. Yeah, That's kind of how what? this happens. There's not a lot of young boys walking around called Larry. No. That was not my grandfather's name, mm -hmm. and yeah. that's kind of a cool or, one. To, they should bring back Larry. Was Larry his name, or was it like something else? No, like, it was Larry. Like, it wasn't Lawrence short, or anything. Lawrence, like, yeah, it was Larry. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Okay. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Well. Enough about names. Yeah, fucking trolling with names here. <laughs> Let us know. Podcast question of the week. Let us know the worst name of a kid you heard. <laughs> or, For me, or it was any, always, anybody. We always made fun of Tanner in videos. <laughs> yeah, yeah. We, but it, it became, that, that's always the name. It became so popular. I feel like now the name you make fun of is like Aiden. 
Like, there's a lot of shit that Aiden's get. I'm sticking with Tanner. Yeah, Tanner is yeah. a classic. That, Tanner? That, okay. I always, I, uh, Tanner, for me, was just um, the shitty kid in every class I was in. Mm -hmm. It was just always, of course, you're Tanner. The chat is right there <laughs> with you, too. always Tanner. Okay, who just took a shit in the corner of the room? <laughs> oh, Tanner. Tanner. Also, like, what's it's always a, Tanner. a name that's fun to yell at? Like, Tanner! 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 Tanner. That's a funny, it sounds funny. <laughs> I still think one of the... One of my uh, career highlights of my life ha was when Nintendo streamed their 2015 uh, E3 promotional video, or, or it was promoting the uh, Nintendo World Championships that were happening. Yeah. And people watching it, and I'm watching the stream, and people in the Nintendo chat are going, feels like Mega64 like filmed this or something. Did they? Does anyone know? And then they were like, oh, we're going to bring in this kid. Come in here, Tanner. Yeah. All right, they did it. They did it. <laughs> yep, that's them. Yep. That, that, I, I was they like knew. cheering in the chat. <laughs> they knew. Oh, man, that made me so happy. Uh, <laughs> so knew. anyway. That kid was great, too. Uh, yeah. more, more from this past week. Again, it was a big week. There's mm -hmm. more? We went to... <laughs> I think the cat's out of the bag, what we did, but we haven't, I haven't shown everything from it yet. People don't know who was there. Mm. Uh, oh, so I'm not going to say that yet. Say yeah, okay. There. Thank you for telling us. The video us. is coming out, but we did go to Boysenberry Festival 2024. Yeah. Booyah. At Knott's Berry Farm in California, where you try all the boysenberry foods. Uh, we went this year. Again, the video is coming. I'm going to put it out Wednesday. Oh, Wednesday, April 10th, I believe. I'm dropping the video. Feature length. Yeah, how long is this? Because oh, this is a lot of footage. Oh, this, this is going to make Dune Part 2 look like uh, Dune Part 1. Wow. wow. It's going to make Dune... It's going to make Dune... It's going to make Dune Part 1 and 2 look like uh, <laughs> Hobbit Part 1 and 2. Oh, whoa. Or uh, no. what's something short? Uh, uh, Lord Charles of the Rings. Oh. <laughs> no. It's going to make Dune look like Brigadoon. I don't know if that is that good. Like Lorna Dune. Dune. Like the, Lorna the, Dune. the, the yeah. 80s cookies. Dune. Yeah. yeah. yeah, yeah. No, so that, anyway, I like that one. uh yeah, so it's gonna be it's gonna be good. But anyway, uh we went. It, it's really funny. You'll see in the video, but I want to talk about maybe some things you won't see in the video, but sure. Uh we I'm sure we bring it up at one point, but we went a year ago and we had essentially the entire theme park to ourselves. It was wonderful. We we went on a random weekday and it was like is this closed? So pleasant. Oh, yeah. You're not closed. Okay. <laughs> but it, it honestly made me feel bad because we were walking around the park and I'm like, all these boysenberry food vendors are open and it's just us. I remember like, we were like, oh, it's is not okay. Yeah. I remember yeah. I was it talking made me about concern that. for them. Yeah, yeah. I'm like, this is boysenberry festival and there's nobody here. You guys went on a roller coaster. I think we, we just picked the right time to go. Yeah, yeah. I think everyone went back to school. Time. Everyone was at work. Yeah. And uh, during a random weekday, and uh, we just timed it right. And mm -hmm. you guys were on a roller coaster. I was just walking around by myself like, oh, my God, all these people are waiting for a sale. But I mean, it's just <laughs> me. There's no one here. So we tried to time it similarly this year and yeah. didn't take when Easter was. In <laughs> that, we, we went around the same time we did last year. We did. But, we, but Easter was way earlier this, this year. I think so. so. Like, we oh. fucked up. Yeah, it was and bad. We got to the park, and it was... To say polar opposite, I mean, doesn't even do it justice. It looked like the population of California was all trying to get in one gate. Descended yeah. on knots. Uh, and it, children by the droves. I saw yeah. three elementary school classes. Yes. Yeah, I saw a bunch of buses. Times. But it made no sense because it was also crazy busy because of spring break. So I was yeah. like, well, which is so, it? So, yeah. yeah, spring break was <laughs> happening. And then schools by the truckload dropping oh, kids yeah. off. It was like... <laughs> so. Is every, everyone just here now? You got tons of families and then droves of teenagers all there to like hang out and be teenagers. Yeah. But then the school rooms had emptied and there's a teacher with 30 kids on leashes. Like, do you see the yes, seriously yep. teacher with the, the, the leash to yeah, leash yeah, to yeah. leash on all the little kids and they're going so, around? It would look like so, some Mad Max shit. So crowded, so many lines. It was it was the fullest I've ever seen Knott's Berry Yeah, Farm. me too. 100%. But, we're, but, we're in like scares, scare zone when we go or whatever. Oh, yeah. Uh, but then it was also kind of a bad intersection too because that was all happening, but also it was a weekday at Knott's. And I, I will say, listen, I love Knott's. If you're coming to California and you have like extra time to look around, Knott's Berry Farm is yeah, a great, it's great place to do it. Uh, more so if you like roller coasters. If you don't, there's a lot of great history there, theme park history. 
So you you might still love it, but if you love coasters, you'll really love it. Mm -hmm. oh, yeah. But anyway, uh, but on weekdays, they don't always have like the most staff. <clears throat> uh, I think they were planning to have more staff during that day. Like, uh, you know, again, it was a very busy time. It was the last week of spring break for mm -hmm. some people. Uh, but we talked to, some, there, but there was only like one person working every station. Yeah. Like I, there'd be a line down the theme park and only one person making like bread bowls for them. And it's like, <laughs> and oh it's my a God. complex bowl. Yeah. 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 And, uh, but, uh, we talked with, I was at first just like, oh, come on, what's going on. But then, um, there was one station we went to again. I will probably, I think we talk about this in the video. There's just this nice old lady serving drinks and she's only doing one at a time to this giant line. And she told one of us there in line, Oh, everyone called out. They, they everyone called in sick today. Ooh. It's just oh. a few of us. It's oh. just, so I guess, I guess it really, you know, it was like, Oh, random weekday. Who cares? Big deal. And, uh, <laughs> oh, no. a, a small crew was left with the biggest crowd I've ever seen. I mean, they were life. overwhelmed. Yeah. At yeah. Every yeah, was, station. Uh, it's so funny. Cause we went to one of the ones we went to later. We went to try uh spoiler. At one point we go to try, they had boysenberry tikka masala. Yeah. Yeah. They, we, we, they they brought Indian food cuisine into knots with the boysenberry fusion, with the boysenberry kick. You'll yeah. see the review in the video. <laughs> but when we went to that booth, the guy was there. Okay, you know, again, every every food booth was the longest line. We didn't do any rides, really. No, we did like I, one. no, we I did do like one. Andy. That was it. Uh, I think after you left, we did like the, okay. the mine train. Yeah, the the yeah. time that I had to be there was completely like using my time in line to get the six food items yeah. that, mm -hmm. for the, for the boysenberry fest. So, uh, but anyway, when I got up there to pay for the thing, another employee walked up to the dude at the register. There, there are four people back there and they're not fucking doing anything. <laughs> get them out here. What oh. are we doing? Like what's happening? Right oh, he's well, yelling. Get them out here. Get them. They, they were whispering to each other oh, in, okay. front, of, in yeah. front of me. Well, they get them out here right now. Why? What the fuck are they doing back? There? I don't know. <laughs> get them out here. And I, and I tried, I was like, I, I'll help you yell at him if you, if, <laughs> if you need backup. I'll, I'll go. I'll go. No, no, no. It's okay. It's a okay. right. new asshole. Yeah. No, but anyway, it was, uh, but it was despite everything we're saying. Oh, it was fun. It had was a, a wonderful yeah. ass day. Yeah, yeah it, it was, was great. It really was. The worst of it really was at the front gates. The front gates were like oh, uh, insufferable. Can I talk about that? Oh, because yeah, yeah, how yeah. I got yelled yeah. at? Yeah. yeah, they have metal detectors and oh, shit oh, now. Oh, all I was going to say is the, the front gates and the security and all that was by far the worst part. Once you got in, it was still very busy, but but manageable, and we had a yeah. pleasant day. Yeah. But not to undersell that opening part, so and you do want you do I'm have walking, a story. I'm walking down, and to, it's horrendous. That uh, line. Let me say too that like for the fucking uh, parking situation at Knotts is not figured out. <laughs> no, know. it still isn't. It's it, they, they've been trying to get them. People have been begging them to build a structure <laughs> for a long time. Oh, yeah? It's been years, and they, yeah. it's like. You're so past the need for that because on busy days they'll have you. Uh, I'll just have them park in some random dirt lot in Which another. Is what yeah. I did, I parked yeah. in another township. Grass. But like I've done that. they <laughs> had me go through like Knott's Berry Farm, the sign, and yeah. people are waving me with those sticks, and I'm like, okay, great. And then they wave me outside the parking lot, and I'm back on the street on my own. Like what? The, yeah. And what you, was the with no instruction? What was the plan? Yeah. Like you were guiding me to leave. Like what? What do you yeah. want me to do? So then I found some fucking. Dirt, yeah, lot. dirt lot. Yeah. It was wild. Um, I, I do want to say I really feel bad about this, yeah. but I, I don't know how I became that guy that day because everyone, when we all met up, had a different story yeah. on, I got sent to some desert. I'm in fucking Arrakis. I parked there. <laughs> and uh, oh, oh, well, I parked by the water park. I parked. I don't know what happened when I rolled up the closed, just the parking lot that's right up front. Right there. Yeah. They saw my car went, oh, right here. Yeah, this parking lot. Yep. That's where I park every time. And this is the one time it was closed. I don't know. For me. Wow, I think yeah. I think they saw my face and went, and he's going to eat a lot. <laughs> <laughs> Let this guy in. He's a they, boysenberry original. So anyway, I didn't mean to you know no. pop off, but for some reason, I lucked out. I was the only one. Yeah. Um, <laughs> but anyway, yeah, yeah, yeah. So yeah. You, you did that. You parked on, a, on another planet. Another that planet. happened to me for Scarefest last year. We did it for, oh, for uh, so sorry, far away. Scare Zone. So the entrance to get in, like, I finally parked, walked all the way there, and then I see the line to, like, go through security, oh. and it's, like, a mile long. Oh, fuck. Really like, that's crazy. Yeah, it was, it was, it was super that's long. That's not an exaggeration. It was a mile. Yeah, yeah. Super yeah. long. I don't know if I can say who was there, but I'm going to say that my, my, my girls were there. That's oh, you spoiled it. Not the girls. Sorry. I brought, I brought the little girls to this. 
Um, Their whole so, monologue is destroyed now. <laughs> they had this great scene. So Sawyer, no, and Lennon, I don't care. I don't care. Sawyer and Lennon are there. So uh, we're walking down, and then we see someone we know. I won't say who. And like, oh, hey, we're all meeting up uh, up here a little bit, and then we'll get in line. I'm like, okay, great. So we start walking, and this woman starts screaming at me. No cutting! No cutting! Hey, you! No cutting! You with the girls, no cutting! We were here first. We were in the line. And I look oh, back <laughs> and I go, are you talking to me? Yeah, I'm not fucking cutting. You're good. And they're like, I'm like laughing. I'm like, what the fuck is that? Yeah. So then like I go forward. I'm just walking. First off, I'm not like in some like only line area. It's a sidewalk. I'm walking on a sidewalk. In yeah, it's just on the sidewalk. Like, yeah. you, what the fuck? So then I <laughs> find everybody else. And then like, I'm like, this fucking psycho lady's yelling at me from cutting. Like my girls are like, are we cutting? I don't want to be cutting. Yeah, we're now not, the kids are scared. We're not yeah. fucking cutting, but this psycho <laughs> is yelling at me. Bro. Dude, bro. was she selling Girl Scout cookies bro. too? Yo, what the fuck? Is She's standing stand in the way of your daughter. But like, it got super awkward and quiet yeah. when she was said that. And I'm like, are you talking to me? But I was like, to me? who are you talking to? Like, I'm not, I'm just catching up with my friends. Like, I have nothing to do with you. Like, go Dude, uh, get dude, the fuck out of here. Sean, like almost gets in a fight everywhere we go. I yeah. don't know what it is. I, I don't know. Literally was walking down a sidewalk and I did nothing. Like I, there's nothing for me to get in a fight with a he's, person. He's always he, dressed in he, all black. He's yeah. Like, hat he's down got low. like I'm holding rage. my cute girls, my little girls <laughs> hands that were walking down there skipping. Yeah, yeah, definitely yell at me. Looks like a criminal. <laughs> yeah. Uh, anyways, so then uh <laughs> we're just standing in line. I'm just like telling everyone like, yeah, the psycho. And then like obviously she is eventually going to catch up to us. Uh -huh. Yeah. So she catches up to us and she sees me and she looks over and goes, I'm sorry. I thought you were cutting. I just thought, I'm like, Pfft. and we all started laughing at her, like in her face, in her dumb kid's face. I'm like, yeah, okay. All right. Thank you. Goodbye. Go, go to your fucking theme park. In her dumb kid's <laughs> face. Like, you no, know, you, you, I, the, the direct quote you gave me when I showed up to all yeah. this, because I didn't know what was going on. Yeah, yeah. When I showed up, I was like, everything okay? And you were like, oh, I just made a new friend. Made a new friend here. That's all. She said, I'm cutting. I'm not. <laughs> anyway, uh, you know, da 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 da, da. and then all this, I uh, just over your shoulder right here. Well, it looked, it looked like, it looked like you were. Um, <laughs> oh, she's still there. She was like still there. It looked, it, it just, you know, it looked stuck. like you were. She was. And, we were um, all standing in the place next to the line, so she was stuck how next awkward. to us, yeah. and we're all just yeah. making fun of her, oh, shit. right? Because it's like, get the fuck out yeah, of yeah. here, <laughs> get the fuck out of here. Also, also, the classic. Okay, I think Kevin, you, you don't know you have a rant ready. Yeah, <laughs> but I'm gonna pull it out. Of okay, you. okay, rant, right? okay. Something has happened at anywhere we go that has security. This it seems like we go through the same thing. I'm gonna speak for you. Kevin. I think I know oh, what you're talking okay. about. But go, go for it. Let's Anytime see. there's security of this nature, the same thing happens where people get to the gates and they all go, "Oh my God, we're we didn't have to go. They didn't put us through security." I hate. We were in line that whole time. We were in line that whole time and we didn't go through security. What was the point of waiting in line? We didn't even go through security. <clears throat> Guys, there is new technology at security points. Am I am I speaking yeah. for you properly? Yeah. By, by yeah. all means, butt in at any point if you no, need no, to. No, no, no. You you got it. There's uh, scanners. There are new scanners at security points that quickly go through your shit. You can just walk right through and it. And if they it, and they only stop you if they detect something dense. Hmm? Like like I've been I've been stopped when I had I had a really thick book. Yeah. Oh. yeah. Even if you have a backpack, it, it if you're if it doesn't sense anything, yeah. you're good. Yeah. You're you good. Metal. You if, if you, you have if, keys. It's yeah. really only looking for dense shit. Yeah. 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 So uh you know a weapon is going to trip it off. You yeah. know any, any, kind, anything, any kind of anything heavy like that. Dense and they thing. they have like a side area for like oh yeah back check and they'll Secondary. they'll go like okay go over there and yeah. do your thing. But these things are so seamless, people don't notice them. And they're like so little you, pillars kind of. Yeah, they're yeah, just yeah. little pillars yeah. on the end of the thing. You just walk through single file. That exists. Um they have it at Disney World now. But I know all kinds of people that go to Disney World that are just like, oh man, yeah, it's crazy. I didn't even go through security there. You did. You at, at every gate that you went to, they had those things. Yeah. Uh, and they'll only pull you aside if there was if you had something really dense. They did yeah. have them at PAX. You're right, Shrewu. Yes, Shrewu they do. Uh, remembers that. And that was but, easy to get in. But same yeah. thing at PAX, dude. There used to be security here. Yeah. It's like they're not checking. There is security. You the, went through it. I keep. I hear all day. They didn't even look at my bag. Oh my god. They I didn't. I, I didn't feel so unsafe, security. and it's like. Technology has fucking advanced <laughs> yeah. Yeah. to make your life easier and you have nothing but to, all you do is complain. <laughs> yeah. Shut up. Just no. walk through the thing. It's checking. 
Just stop it. Yeah, like, and, and this happened. It, it's funny how there is technology. We've talked about this before. Yeah. There is technology that actually, when it gets better, people actually do get more licensed to complain. Yeah, I, I don't get and it. That's one of them. No, no, no. But that's one of them that people just don't realize. Yeah. Is there like, I can't, I feel so unsafe. I didn't go through oh, security. Well, no, unsafe. we made the tech so good that you don't have to open your you're, bag. You don't even feel like you're going through security. Um, like, but it happens with, I remember reading about um, all the, when they opened um, Epcot in mm -hmm. the 80s. They were like, look, there's big lines. Look at like uh, Disneyland in California. There's such big lines. Let's make such people sucker rides. Yeah. Like rides that'll process 4,000 people an hour so that, we don't, so that no one's waiting in yeah, line. We don't want this to happen again. We don't want a mile long line for this ride. So let's design it so it never has that. Yeah. And then what happens? All the news stories, damn, no one in line for any of these rides. Yeah. I guess, I guess fa fa failure you can't ride. Win. You know what failure I mean? Ride. But it's like, so now it almost benefits them to not have a ride be that big because, it, well, it's more expensive to make it that big, but people see no line and go, huh, flop. Yeah. So it's like, okay, then fucking make them wait. Yeah, you know? I, don't, like, I don't know. There's certain things that uh, you just, your brain goes, it should be like this. And it's when it's not, it throws you off. But also too, speaking of theme parks, Disneyland in California is like the only one left that I know that doesn't have those. Nope, there's still the metal no detectors. Sense. They still stop you. Okay, let me go through every pocket of your bag. Uh, yeah. It's like, everybody else has that yeah, tech just, now. I just want to walk through. It's easy. Yeah, that, that is. Sick. I do like that tech and I do like uh, how little security is in Knott's Berry Farm. Oh, I saw security <laughs> uh, yelling. Because, you know, Knott's Berry Farm has this new rule mm -hmm. yeah. where it's like you can't be a minor by yourself. Well, because yeah. they, they, they have the chaperone. chaperone policy, they have some yeah. gang yeah. violence. So I saw yeah. kids who I saw, were probably like 17 yep. being kicked out. I saw some teens get in, tr in trouble because they were, they, were, they were security just rolling up just like, hey, what are you doing? Stop doing that. Yeah. Like, yeah. Just well, teenagers being parents. teenagers. Because there's a lot of teenagers on spring break in there just, you know, but being, I being teenagers. Hey, yeah, honestly yeah. though, like, I used to go do that. Yeah, to hang out. Shit. And like, yeah, we were probably being assholes, but I'm 40. I'm still being an asshole. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> we're filming. <laughs> being assholes is fine. Just have to have a camera and a YouTube channel now. <laughs> yeah, there you exactly. go. Exactly. Uh, but but I, I was going to say, like, it's so different and such a stark contrast to how Disney yeah, operates. Yeah, Disney is oh, way yeah, different. Security everywhere, cameras everywhere, and they're not seen, but they're there and they pull themselves out of the shadows and get you, right? Yeah. But at Knott's Berry Farm, it's just like, I saw about 80 dads just ripping their vapes while they walk through the fucking yep. line at a park. <laughs> or, yeah. you know, like, yeah. there's little nooks and crannies where you get away with anything, and yeah. there's really not a lot of security at Knott's Berry no. Farms. Uh, it, it the is whole park is a smoking section. <laughs> I do remember when the all the theme parks opened, uh, you know, post COVID. Yeah, and but you remember all of them still had strict guidelines. Like, okay, okay, everyone in line is six feet from each other. Oh, right. You gotta, you know, sanit. Some parks were like, you gotta hand sanitize before you get in the ride. You got. They were very lots of rules, and Disneyland was like run like a military. It was like, did you? Just, oh yeah. Are you wait? You're within five feet of someone. One more foot. There you go. Okay. I mean, they There's were those stickers precision. on the ground. That was they, wild. Yeah, and they were and they were watching the lines like a hawk. Yeah. Like, mm -mm, don't move forward yet. Okay. And honestly, <laughs> I okay. We were people came out of the woodwork when I was there, and like, yeah. uh, put your mask back on. Like, yeah, like, yeah. Oh you, shit! You, They're yeah. saying a sip with their coke. Yeah. yeah. Like, oh my god. And and I, and let me tell you, I went that first week it opened, um, and I still think back to what, how there was no way everything looked like it had a gnarly weight but it was just because everyone was spaced six feet yeah, yeah. You know, all the line for uh you know the pirates of the caribbean is going down the yeah. street yeah but it it, that's to. five people that's doesn't not, have the space yeah, yeah. Uh -huh. so it went quick uh every time yeah and i and i'll never forget to this day doing it'll be the only time probably in history i did rise of the resistance by myself wow like i was in there wow. alone and it was like oh my god there's no one else in here yeah that was so crazy but anyway uh, but, uh, what was I going to get? Oh, but with knots, they were not doing that. And I remember going like, Oh, knots is back open. Let's go. And it was like, okay, someone is against my back and they're coughing. Yeah. Like, 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 <laughs> what the fuck is happening? And if anybody complained, it was like, eh, why is this guy complaining? And it's like, man, this is not the same as Disney. That's yeah, Disney's down the street. If you yeah. don't like it. Yeah. Yeah. It's like everyone there just did it to open the back, the park back up. Yeah. yeah okay. Yeah, whatever. Yeah. yeah. Um, but anyway, so yeah, boysenberry festival. Um, it was we, fun. We ate a lot of shit. You'll had see a good it. Time. You'll see it in the video. I can't wait. But overall, had a spectacular day. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Um, and I was uh, stuffed. And I cut so many I was lines. stuffed too. You did? Oh, no. Oh, you cut. actually, I did. I, we cut once. <gasps> what? We did. But it was oh. one of those things where, like, 
uh, Sora had to go to the bathroom, and so that we met up with everyone and then got in the line. But she was like, "I don't want to get that lady to find us." I'm like, "We're this is <laughs> this is not the same thing." I know like, what you're we're talking about. Too. Our She's got like, the fear in her. Yeah, now. this crazy lady ruined everything. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> oh man! But yeah, that was a uh, Boysenberry Festival. Yeah, so check that's it out coming, on Wednesday, and that's coming to your personal channel. Yes, that'll be on. Um, yeah, we all have different YouTube channels. Case again, if you're new to the situation. Sure. Um, Rocco, I'm Rocco Bodie on, well, I am just Rocco Bodie. There but, he is. Um, there my he YouTube is. channel, youtube.com slash Rocco Bodie. Um, this isn't a cameo exclusive. No, no, this no. Year. no. This year. Okay. It's all going to be on, on, uh, on my YouTube channel. And then, um, I've got other stuff coming too. I beat, I finally made the time. I took a, by the way, I want to say too, I, I took a personal day yesterday. No, oh. it was the first time in so long that I could think of where it's like, oh, I have a day and I, I just to myself and I have nothing to do. Yeah. It had been a while for mm -hmm. me. When you say oh. personal day, it sounds like you took a day off work, but it was a Saturday yesterday. You had yeah, yesterday. Yeah, yeah. Usually Rocco works every you day. You do work here <laughs> kind of around the clock though, I will yeah, say. But yeah, but like yeah. a day where I don't even have personal shit I gotta do. Oh, like, like you don't even have to go like, to the bank. It was like, oh, I'm gonna sleep in till it's fucking dark. Like, yeah. I'm just not. Anyway, oh my God. Slept in, slept in late. Fucking, I put the Vision Pro on in bed and watched fucking uh, Masters of the Air or whatever. Ooh. Looking at, I'm fucking just, I mean, it, lo it looked, it, uh, you know, I always hate when people, oh, Apple Vision Pro, oh, dystopian, oh, whatever. But I fucking look dystopian when I was like <laughs> in my underwear, laying on my back <laughs> in my bed with the VR headset, just, oh, you know, it was great. Uh, How far are you in that show? Just the first episode. Oh, okay, okay. It was cool. I finished it. Um, I recommend it highly. But uh, I did that and then, Eventually, I got out of bed and I made those cheese biscuits. Oh, oh yeah. I, I, still, I still had another box, yeah. cheddar bay. box yeah, yeah. of those uh, cheddar biscuits. So I made those and then just got back in bed. It was Dang. Great. Oh, it was great. Wow. But I beat uh, Final Fantasy VII Rebirth. Oh, I, I fell off. I finally did. You did. You beat it. I, I had the last little bit of it left for like weeks. It's like, yeah. oh my God, when the fuck am I going to just get to finish, finish that it. part? Yeah. But I did. I'm going to do a whole uh, the reason I bring it up now is I'm going to do a whole video on my personal channel because I could talk like an hour about it. Like, okay. Yeah, yeah. I'm not going to do that here. I don't. I I respect you guys. Much. <laughs> uh, yeah, because I haven't beat it yet. So yeah. you, I don't want to be spoiled. Yeah. Me yet. yeah. Um, so I'm gonna, I'll, I'll do a whole video about it. I have a lot to say, but now that I've beat it, I have a lot of thoughts on it. I But I, I will say here overall, I enjoyed it much more than the last okay. one. Uh, but I didn't even hate the last one. I had a lot of criti I had a lot of criticisms of the last one. But like overall was like, okay, cool. I love the gameplay. But yeah, the gameplay was awesome, but I just there were a lot of things I'm like, Story why would you do stuff. this? Yeah. And I I still got dragged so hard on that. It was, "Oh my god, you're such a hater." I'm like, I, "No, I just I want these to be better." I just mm -hmm. I don't I didn't say I hate. I bought the fucking soundtrack it's your and all opinion, the too. figures and all that stuff. Uh, but this one I felt like I felt more like I got a real Final Fantasy game with this one. Like, I feel like I got a, I felt like Remake was in this weird, like, what is this kind of thing? And then this one actually felt like I got a full, yeah. Okay. Full I feel experience. like I got, I feel like I got a mainline Final Fantasy Fuck game. Fuck yeah. Okay. Um, there, there were still though a handful of things that I'm like, wh why would you do this? Um, <laughs> that, that were insane to me. And I'll talk about that in the video, but overall, I feel like I, I feel like this was more what I was hoping the last one would be. So overall, cool. a positive review. Cool. But some things, man, I'll talk about them in my video. Drove me nuts. And I'm curious if people felt the same way or if I'm a, a big baby. I know it I'm could, a big baby. It could be both. I know, I know I'm a big baby. But it could be both. I'm curious. We'll see. <laughs> we shall see. I haven't played a game in a very long time. What was the last one you played? Uh, well, Red Dead 2 on well, the Steam Deck. But like I've been playing, but like I haven't like bought a new game. Yeah, because you're and, replaying Red Dead 2 yeah, a second yeah, time. Yeah, I can't mm. think of a game that... What like, about like Red Dead 1 when you first got that? Oh, on Switch? Yeah. I played I that Switch. on tour. Yeah, you yeah, I, I've been... That was November. I, played a, I, I mean, I haven't beat it or anything, but yeah. I, I haven't played that. But I haven't like... I can't think of a, a new game I'm also either excited for. Like, what am I excited yeah. for? Uh, upcoming? Sandland. Yeah. Sandland, Sean. You Sandland, Sean. Sandland? You went to PAX? You oh, so Toriyama died for nothing? You're yeah, dude. I was so he jealous. He died for nothing. You went to PAX East. You got to take a picture next to that big-ass tank. Yeah. <laughs> you didn't even take a photo for me. You know how much I love Sandland? I didn't know that. All right. No. <laughs> I'm sorry. You're not going to play the Elden Ring DLC? 
Yeah, Seriously? So. I'm, I'm, I'm How about the new Fatal Fury? I'm thinking, uh, what, what is it? Oh yeah, the Elden Ring DLC is like next week, right? Yeah, next week. Mm. I think it's like Monday. No, oh my God, is it tomorrow? tomorrow? Johnny. 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 Is it tomorrow? I don't think it got announced yet. I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> Shit. What, the Elden Ring DLC? I don't know if it comes out soon. I thought it was like, oh, hey, I was joking, is... it's, it's June. It's June. Oh, yeah. June. Uh... <laughs> Johnny didn't even know that? I set it up for you, dude. You fucking Garrett believed it. <laughs> oh, and that's you know, I I got um Javier gave me MLB the show 2024. Oh hell haven't yeah. Haven't had time to play it yet. I've load I, I've installed it. Okay. I haven't played it. I'm very excited. But uh that I mean I've been I, so pulled away from Final Fantasy VII uh rebirth because I got that mod for fixed oh, camera angles that. in Resident Evil 2 remake to oh, work. Yeah. Dude, yeah, I was yeah, yeah. I was at Garrett's house. Oh, Looking yeah. at it, it looks incredible. It, 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 it was legit. It's so if you are a fan of tank controls and the original three Resident Evil games, it's a mod for the PC version yeah. of Resident Evil Two Remake. So were you looking at it? Was it like hooked up to his TV on the on the yeah. Steam Deck? Or just, oh, okay. TV. Okay. Was it hard to get it working? Yes. Oh, <laughs> because I've never. But I can. I I know how to do it now. Yeah. But for me, I've never modded a PC game. I've never yeah. fucking played a PC game after like Quake. Yeah, you know, like an Unreal tournament. Like, yeah, yeah, yeah. I, I, I have Steam for some stuff, and I will use it for those games that are exclusive to that. Like Signalis, I really mm -hmm. wanted to play before that got PlayStation and everything. So yeah. I, I was playing that on my Steam Deck. That's kind of why I got a Steam Deck because I don't have a PC. At home. I don't have a PC. That is my PC. My exactly. Steam Deck. And yeah, it, me it gave me yeah. a way to play these PC games now at home with the dock on my big screen, mm -hmm. and um, even all the mods that were coming out for. Metal Gear 5 over the last years that really looked cool never kind of got me yeah, into yeah. it. But I always thought if one of them did it, it'd be some final or some uh, Metal Gear 5 mod. Yeah. But no, it was this it was Resident, Resident Evil mod. That's cool. It, but I honestly, looking at it, it looked like it was just a feature of the game. Like I did not realize it was like a, well, it was a well mod done mod. By yeah. okay. It looks so legit. It was. Uh, wow. <clears throat> it was. It was. It was relatively easy. Uh, uh, it, there's just like three steps. It's like you have to run like. A program behind the game, kind of. You have to install and change some code in a DLL file. Okay. Um, but I, I can help you get that running. I have all the files already downloaded, cool. so you don't even have to make a Nexus Mods account. Yeah. But uh, it's if you like those original style of games, it just puts the beautiful skin on, on the, the original tank controls. Game now. Okay. Yeah, it's fantastic. That's sick. Uh, so I've been so sucked into that, like I haven't been back on Final Fantasy or anything. Yeah. I was um I was really excited to I kind of want I wanted to play Final Fantasy out the gate because I really was worried that would be the thing that was spoiled for me because uh -huh. I want it's like oh my god whenever that people are gonna spoil the ending you know I have an idea kind of where this is going to wrap up so like people are gonna spoil it I, I got to beat this as fast as possible and I wasn't able to but no one ever spoiled it and then when I beat it I realized that ah that's why it. I don't know how you would. Okay, because oh, okay. yeah, I was gonna say I haven't heard anything uh, yet it's, either. Yeah, it's difficult to to discuss. say how it ends. <laughs> uh, but um, but I finally did it. Whatever, and what I put off was like a dragon, infinite wealth. Now I, oh, I as yeah. soon as I was done with that, I started that on my uh, uh, Steam Deck. Oh, so nice. I'm playing, I think I'm gonna play that on my Steam Deck while I'm like here and stuff, mm -hmm. and then uh. At home, I'm. An, I really want to start that Last of Us two remake. Yeah, like, I just beat I that. I never, never checked into that. Oh, you beat that? Yep. You totally did. I totally okay. beat it, and I played all the extra uh, cut levels that they added. Re oh, that they, yeah, they added like deleted shit. They added right? three um, deleted levels from the game. Yeah, uh, for pacing reasons, and they put it back in with like commentary and all this stuff. It's awesome. It's it's such a good like set of like the documentaries on there. They just put out the Grounded two or whatever. It's it's all on there. Is that that's that's included? In included. The it's it's oh, on I the disc. I didn't know that. Yeah, you can just play it on, in, from the menus and stuff. Wow, that's really cool. Yep. Um, I really want to play it with you. I guess you can play it with commentary. Yep. So yeah, Trish has been doing that. That's what I want to do. Yeah, I've yeah, never yeah, seen yeah. a game do that. And, I've never heard yeah. of that. Valve, I walked in the Valve house. Was the first one I saw do that, and it was awesome. Oh, that's so yeah, cool. Valve Portal Two. You you um you can play it with commentary, Dude, and you go through like, yeah, we tried doing this this level this way, wow. but everybody kept doing this one thing, and we're like, we can't do that. So that's oh. like, awesome. Like, and that's it, so cool. It's such cool like commentary All right, to listen. Coming up, Duke Nukem commentary. <laughs> Doug right, Hugum. Doug Hugum, rather what I say. 
<laughs> I don't know. I don't know the game. I, I don't know who. I don't know who that <laughs> know is. The other thing. Sorry, there was chocolate milk there. <laughs> <laughs> That's cool. Uh, yeah. Anyway, so I I want to do that. I always like to have. I always like to have a game queued up that I could play at home mm -hmm. on like, you know, the PlayStation or whatever, and one that I'm playing portable. So that like when I'm either at home or here, yeah, I'm playing that. I, I always kind of have two games going yeah, simultaneously. And I'm, I'm weird like this, like they can't be the same either. I can't do like two RPGs, like, you know, oh, Final Fantasy at home and this one here. No, I, it's like, I only have time for one. Mm -hmm. So like, Maybe portable if I'm here, I'm playing like Tetris, but then at home I could play Yakuza or whatever. So they have to, the, the world has to balance out. That's the only way I can play games and beat multiple games. Uh, so Last of Us is very different than Like yeah. a Dragon. So I, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to try to make my way through both of those. I cool. think, I don't know what else I'm looking forward to this year in That's terms of, game, yeah. those were like the big you, you, ones like like metal gear that snake eater oh, remake Delta. could yeah. uh, could could be that, bad that, i don't know that's it kind of a good. mystery i don't know if that's this year yeah i'm definitely getting that just based on it's a metal gear game i'm so curious to see yeah i am excited for the Silent Hill 2 remake which i think is going to be this year i think they yeah I don't know, but again could be bad but that's is a game i'm excited for it's a remake of one of my favorite games ever yeah so i checked that one out too this is the year that covid really affected things where it's like the 2020 things, production people, people are making uh, shit and it's a couple years later. I feel and like we're, uh, we keep saying that people keep saying that about stuff, but I feel like we were kind of saying it last year. And then from the end of last year through the beginning of this year, I feel like, again, we had such a diarrhea of amazing games mm, yeah. that I just feel like they all came out. They're all, yeah. yeah. That's what I think. Yeah. But um, yeah. yeah, no one wanted to start anything new though. Maybe after. Yeah, I guess you're right. Yeah, I think I think last year was actually like a phenomenal year. Like like yeah, last year so much shit came out. Mm -hmm. Uh, do you think uh, is what's the next big like, Nintendo thing? Is there anything that's like I Nintendo? think I think it's gonna be quiet until the new Switch. Yeah, really. I think like they have they have th it feels it feels like that time right now because they're they keep announcing stuff and it's like oh yeah that re released that yeah re-release this re-release yeah. that they're not gonna it's be like, working on yeah. new games for this switch i think i think they're done with that i think that this fall you'll hear okay here's all the new stuff coming to the new switch and it's coming march 2020 yeah it's gonna be a surprise that's, date that's what so we're not gonna, gonna hear shit from them <laughs> until but we'll hear some stuff but it would probably be lower like remake stuff and things like that's that. that's what i think i think you're like oh yeah you're gonna get your uh twilight princess it's gonna be on switch finally you're i think gonna... we'll get more gamecube games yeah ported over like we okay. were with like a uh, thousand year door and stuff like that it's weird to me that didn't happen already I, yeah, I, yeah. I, I still I can't believe blown away that it hasn't happened more till just now yeah really i don't uh, get that speaking of nintendo i think the big news that i heard this week was that they're shutting down the wii u and the 3ds servers yeah the store was already uh, gone store's been but gone, now right? like the straight up online stuff so you can't gone. play splatoon one that okay. will not work just i mean there's no game yeah there's no oh. Oh. uh mario kart 7 which i have been not remember i always say eight. like i'm not buying the switch version of mario kart yeah. i already own it on the wii u mario kart or the eight. eight that was mario kart oh, eight. That's our, okay yeah, eight, yeah, yeah. sorry so now here I am. You gotta do it. I you fucking, should have bought it on Switch. I know. I have to now because my <laughs> it's better on Switch anyway. It, it's so it much is, better. It's it's oh, called it's called Deluxe, and they I added know. all this I cool know. stuff. But that was always my my caveat. It's like, well, it'll work on the Wii U, but it'll still work single player. You but, better get your your Breath of the Wild DLC before it goes down, dude. Shit. Oh, yeah. <laughs> You're right. All my Breath of the Wild is on. The Wii U. I still. I was just. I never got that. the horse. I was just talking about that on our stream the other night. I I can't. I it blows. I. Breath of the Wild was on the Wii U. That blows yeah, my. Yeah, I never yeah. saw yeah. it. I never saw that. Yeah. And then it, the as, the years, it. as the years go by, I'm just like, oh, that was on there. Like, I want to see that. I want. I kind of want to like get it. House. Yeah, yeah. He's fucking. Isn't isn't he swinging with the other hand? His sword in that. Oh, that's two consoles ago. That was. Oh, that was and the that was Twilight. Twilight Princess yeah, on right. the Wii. I remember that. <laughs> I think that's. That's what a, little, a weird game mechanic that yeah. has now ha had to change for yeah. the mechanics of the physical hardware, yeah. but fundamentally screwed up the lore of the character that he was always left-handed. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. It, it was just an interesting time in Zelda. Yeah, they flipped it for the motion control. Yeah. Yes, because yeah. so, most, most people were right handed, right -handed so they yeah. flipped it so you could hold your sword in the right so hand. So did he stay a right-handed character then after that? Like in in Breath of the Wild, I, I never noticed. That. I don't know. I never yeah. noticed. 
like any difference or anything like that. Um, but yeah. what sound does he make, Sean? I don't know. Link when he swings his sword. How you did? Okay. Hey. hey. Yeah. Hey. See. hey. That's, that's that's more it. like hey. it. That's it. Uh, the the one <laughs> the one game I could think of though that I am actually looking forward to legitimately, and I feel like I never it's it's never an Xbox game, but that Indiana Jones. Game. Oh, that looks cool. I actually want to play yeah. that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I actually want to play that when it comes out. I hope it's because I want a new Uncharted, and that's good enough for me. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Yeah. I mean, that's why they made Uncharted was Indiana Jones. Yeah, and yeah. So it's just that, and you'll be able to. It, it, they they came out and said like you know all these games are also going to come to PlayStation and all that, but like and then they were like oh but Indiana Jones is like not one of those. That's things. just Xbox. That's Xbox oh. exclusive. But all the Xbox exclusives come to PC, so that means Steam, Steam Deck. Steam Deck. So you're playing on Steam Deck. Okay. 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 There you go. Um, Kevin, got any goodies? We do have goodies. Oh, oh, yes, dude. I was really hoping because I think I think Johnny installed a goodie cam. If I'm not mistaken, can we get a shot? Ooh, oh, look at that. We have goodie yeah. cam, cam, everybody. Goodie <laughs> cam. Hey, uh, everybody. If you want to <laughs> wow. send stuff, if you want to send us goodies, you always can. We have a PO box. You want to send us a letter, a card, a question, a gift, whatever. Send it to Mega 64 P.O. Box 713090, Santee, California, 92072. Well, I don't know. This is like... You don't know what kind of goodies it got? Real quick. Does it's, it have a name on it or something? Like that? What, what could it be? Oh, it looks good. Dibs. Oh, now this actually, this is for Rocco. Was Christ-like? <laughs> <laughs> what? Wow. The story of Jesus. It's a comic about oh, Jesus. I needed Christ. that for Easter. Ooh. Jesus Christ. Look at this. Saves and he can off the wall. Uh, oh, Yosemite. oh, look, and the one below it. Look at that. There's two in there. Oh, yeah. Over Grand the, Canyon. Yeah, the Grand Canyon. That's the ones you read in the gift shop. <laughs> Johnny's got dibs on those. Dobbs. Dobbs. Yeah. Dobbs. Do Johnny's got Dobbs oh on those. God, look, look at that. that. What is, I don't even know what the, All the, deaths. the cover of that one is. It's what covered is up. The, the one Garrett has. Dude, that picture right there, overhead cam, if you don't mind, Johnny. It's a skeleton. This is a, that's a dead body. <laughs> oh, so is this too? Dude, that's also a dead body. It's fucking Yikes. Logan Paul shit. All right. Whoa. Don't film those. <laughs> Don't film those. Sean, do you want to reveal the cover of the secret magazine? Yeah, I can't tell. Is it which. okay to show it? I didn't look. I, I don't know. Oh. I just kind of set him up. <laughs> I could have fucked good. you. We're good. Ready? Alien. Whoa. Oh. An the illustrated, illustrated story. story. Heavy Alien? Metal presents Alien. Oh, this is sick. It's a comic? Oh, is it like fucking... Alien Alien? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, yeah. the Mad yeah. Alien. Yeah. Alien. Oh, that book is oh, dope. Oh, that's cool. This is really cool. Was there a letter? I no, didn't see one in no, there. No, I think it was just a name on the box. Wow. Yeah, I don't know. We're going to be fighting over Alien. Dude, this... No, Dobbs. No, yeah. Oh, Kev. Sorry, oh, Kev. Shit, Sorry. Kevin got no it. No fight involved. Kevin got it. Yeah. We're all Sorry, about peace Derek. here. Well, you can have this one, Garrett. That's for you. The story of Dude, I have it. so much. I don't know who sent that. But thank you. But thank you. Yeah. Yeah, that's awesome. It doesn't say on the box. It says on the box. Oh, we Silver threw the box. There. Got it. <laughs> Garrett it. chucked it away. Ethan S. Is it? It's from Ethan. Ethan, thanks, thank Ethan. You, thank Ethan. you so much. Is there anything else in the box? No. Or no, no, no notes. It? No, not that's nope. it. That's it, and that's all. Cool. Well, thank you very much. Thank you very thank much, you very Ethan. Much, Ethan. Thank you, as I as anybody has sent us to our P.O. box. Yeah. Thank you for all the gifts that we receive. We always appreciate it. And I can't it. wait to find out what happened to this guy. Um, <laughs> uh, you know, it really, I don't know. I don't want to spoil it because Passion 2 is coming out. Oh, yeah. <laughs> oh, I don't okay. know. don't well, spoil Passion 2 for me. I think you can find out what happened to him in our hit game, Doug Hugum, <laughs> available oh, now yeah. on our website. <laughs> Dude, I, I, uh, a dark turn of events here because this is the third revision that means like people keep dying and they keep adding oh, to no. oh, what well, happened people, people are always gonna die now with 20 more child deaths no come on the, the one in the grand canyon oh there's a fucking thing in here what is that oh photo what is this oh a ticket <laughs> it's, it's a flight whoa it's a it's airline it's ticket a flight. <laughs> you almost <laughs> docked someone I, yeah well let's does see. it have their like social on it or no what? but it, <laughs> why did you have a social on your flight ticket? oh you whoa. don't fill that out <laughs> i put that on my it's the luggage bad, tag it's the yeah yeah fee. For this person on their flight. You know what that is weird? Because yeah. you have to, with your taxes, I have to mail a check. Yeah. yeah. I just, it's tax season, right? I just yeah. Pay yeah. My taxes. 
They they want you to write your social on the, check, on the yeah, fucking check. Yeah. And I that skeeves me out so bad. It goes <laughs> against everything I've ever heard of. It's like, don't put this on anything. I think they already got it. So. Yeah. <laughs> uh, ironically, this person flew from San Diego to Portland. So where did the person, where did, sorry, who, Ethan? Ethan. Yeah, where did Ethan buy this book? I don't know. I don't know. Maybe they're in San Diego. It was. I ran into a, a Mega Six Deforian. Uh, today out in the wild. Dang. <laughs> in the wild. Or did I they was, run into you? I was walking the dogs out of the dog park. You know what? Yeah, is, maybe they ran into me. It is interesting. Like the, this one, I think, has like, okay, how many like women have died in the Grand Canyon? Yeah. Okay, how many kids? How many men? It's like this is fucking crazy. Yeah. All these like. So who's sad, winning? Yeah. Who? who oh, it's <laughs> obviously smarter. the dumb men are yeah. winning. Uh, like we have. I, <laughs> infinitely more deaths i remember when you guys are going out to the ledge i'm like i'm not doing that and so i was like why not I'm like because people die all the time eat. falling in he's like no no and then we found a book like this or this book <laughs> yeah, it was this book, yeah. <laughs> you're right kevin uh, looking back on what me and johnny did on that little you were like you were out there we were out oh, you were there. Out what there. if i was gone and you guys had it on film that then, yeah. then I, there's a there's a thing of Rocco filming that like every part of me wants to do that, but I have kids at home and Jenny would not like it. I'm yeah, not yeah. doing uh, it. Uh, uh. But like my reaction too is like I want to get to the edge of that cliff. Like why? What is that? Why? <laughs> why would I have that thought? <laughs> Johnny and I got nothing to live for. Dude, it's like a mile <laughs> down. You should check it out. Okay, <laughs> that made him laugh. Like, <laughs> yeah, right. It's a, it's a mile straight my, down. Go and look at this. I look at my nihilism makes Johnny laugh. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah, it was good. Well, anyways, yeah. thank you for a great week yes. at Mega64. You guys yeah. all made it possible. Appreciate everyone. Special shout out again to the Get Bonus crew. Thank you guys. Yeah. Uh, Brandon mm-hmm. and the crew. Yeah, yeah, check out their stuff. Get bonus at uh getbonus.itch.io. Yep. Cool. Definitely check them out. And I mean, again, the Citizen Kane 64 speaks for itself. Like that <laughs> yes. that's such a good thing. So yeah. uh everyone, thank you so much. And we will see you next week. Yeah. Same time, same we, place. Hey, we uh we uh do a little extra. We have we always have a little extra conversation after the show. Maybe we'll read a couple deaths in our uh <laughs> we call it we call it post show clarity. Yeah. And uh and you can find an archive of those up on our Patreon, as well as a bunch of other exclusive shows. Um, you can support Mega 64 and get hours and hours of exclusive stuff every week. Patreon.com slash mega sixty four. Go check that out. And we're maybe we'll read some now. Um, but yeah, yeah. All right. Take care, everybody. Thank you. Thank you guys Thanks for watching. We'll see you next time. No fade, please. <laughs> oh, asking you shall receive. <laughs>